everybody. Oh yeah, it's Penny time. How's it going? Welcome to a 4 p.m. stream beginning. Uh, cause I wanted to play more of the video game, so that's what we're gonna do. Um, I it is dawning on me just how little time I have to um to beat this game star wars time is anytime like now true so true also hi holly how's it going um yeah it, it's 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 been dawning on me today specifically it's been really dawning on me just how um, how how much video game we have to get through in the next few months um i just now today really processed the fact that uh Tears of the Kingdom comes out in like two weeks, which is insane. That's gonna that's gonna fly by like nothing. Um, and then we basically have like all of May to play both Jedi Survivor and Tears of the Kingdom, and hopefully either finish both of them or at least get to a reasonable point of progress with both of them. And we have a little bit more time in June, but then swiftly in June, specifically, what is it? Uh, June. Oh, it's June 22nd. Actually, we have a ton of time. I don't actually think that beating all of these games... Oh, it, it, by the way, June 22nd is Final Fantasy 16, essentially. I don't think that beating these three games in the allotted time is going to be very difficult but it also it's it right now it's basically the thing is that it's dawning on me how close we are to tears of the kingdom specifically and then we have like a decently long wait after tears of the kingdom until ff16 but from this release to zelda oh my god so <laughs> basically all that to say i want to get through as much of Jedi Survivor as possible in the next two weeks, specifically because I assume when Zelda comes out, I'm probably going to want to play that almost exclusively for a long time. <laughs> because one, it's probably going to be really good. And two, I do not want to be spoiled on anything after it comes out i don't want to be in a situation where i'm like lagging behind and everyone else is playing like hours and hours and hours ahead of me are we still gonna get dq8 that's a good question i don't know i hope so but the thing about it is that when tears of the kingdom comes out i'm probably gonna have that take the wednesday slot so dragon quest 8 might have to take a small hiatus in the interest of getting through Tears of the Kingdom in a reasonable amount of time so that I'm not playing it for like months and months and months, right? So, um, I don't know. It, yeah, so DQ8 might have to take a small hiatus, unfortunately. Um, but the thing about it is that that's a long game. That game was going to be taking a long time anyway. I'm okay with, with uh, you know, putting it on the back burner for a couple weeks um, if it's in the interest of... Uh, let's just say search engine optimization <laughs> of my channel. Um, yes, there's still plan to finish Murder of Sonic. Uh, I've <laughs> literally, every single time someone asks, I have to say, yes, I promise we'll get there. It's gonna be soon. I will tell you when I am 112% certain that it's locked in. Um, <laughs> Murder of Sonic is canceled forever because Sonic got real sick. Sorry, everybody. Yeah, actually, I was lying. I'm sorry. I'm trying to be a people pleaser. Um, yes. Uh, so God. Okay, hold on. What? Well, uh, so what was I saying? Let's see. Uh, yeah. So Dragon Quest Eight. What I'll probably do is next Wednesday I will do a DQ Eight session. And then Wednesday the, Wednesday the 10th, I will do a DQ8 session. 
And if I have not figured out a better situation for Dragon Quest VIII by that time, then it will go on a short hiatus starting on the 10th. And then I will slot uh, Tears of the Kingdom into the Wednesday slot. Although, truth be told, Tears of the Kingdom is probably going to be, like I said, like probably the main thing I stream for at least like a couple weeks or so. Um, so I could, I could feasibly see Tears of the Kingdom being like not just the Wednesday slot, but the Wednesday, Tuesday, um, and then weekend slot as well. Like, I don't know. It's going to be crazy for the next little bit. Um, I am both excited and also fearful, but that's, that's all on me to figure out. I just hope that I can do so in a way that is enjoyable, but we're not here for that today. Today, uh, we're going to, we're going to play more Jedi Survivor because, because honest to God, last night I had a great time. That was, that was a, a wonderful sort of re reignition of, um, my excitement for the rest of this game. Yeah, we met Turgle, baby! We fucking met Turgle! We met Turgle Marink himself! Um, and everything is better now, truthfully. Turgle saved the game in more ways than he could ever know. And I hope that we get just, you know, hours upon hours of Turgle content in this game. And if not, Bad game, bad game, bad game, bad game, uh, death beam, death ray at the video game, bad game. Okay? Okay. So, I am actually not going to wait very long. Uh, did the game start performing better? Um, yes, but <laughs> not, not for the reasons you may think. We just switched to the PS5 version, and we've been playing on quality mode, which is which is locked at 30, which, fortunately, on PS5, this game can do reasonably well um the the quality locked at 30 mode on ps5 runs pretty decent um so it's it was it, it it's a good experience so far it has been much 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 better than uh trying to brute force it on pc so thumbs up it's been good um not perfect there have been a couple of hitches here and there and also personally I'm able to notice some weird, like some crazy weird, like fuzziness in the way that it's rendering its its 4K upscaling. I assume when the internal resolution drops a little bit under, um, uh, a little bit under the uh, the exact like 4K native resolution, because uh, I assume the game is heavy enough and unfortunately poorly optimized enough that uh, even in the quality mode, you're not hitting like native 4K all the time because it's it it does seem like there's some uh like upscaling going on um even though it is like close to 4k in a lot of instances especially on cal's face uh and again this could just be me seeing it on my monitor i don't know how much the stream quality kind of crunches it up enough to where it becomes not very noticeable but for me seeing it on just like a native 4k screen right in front of me like Cal's face in particular, when the camera moves and it pans onto his face, it's crazy. And then also, so far, cutscenes have still been a bit of a, a sore point performance-wise. The cutscenes have contained the most frequent and noticeable frame drops uh, since switching to PS5, which is unfortunate because for the cutscenes, you want to be like, you want to be tuned in, you know, but whatever. So far, it has been a much more pleasant experience. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and get started uh, because I'm excited to play. And uh, we left in a sort of um, sort of transitional area right now. Uh, we just went to the basement of uh, uh, Greasy's Greasy's Cantina. Um, or no, this isn't. Wait, it's there's there's something. What's the name of this place? It's got another name. Pylon Saloon. I love your little robot. I know nothing about this game, but I'm glad the droid designs are still fun. They are. Okay, this is BD1. Oh, Holly, you've activated uh, gush mode. Okay, so this is BD1. Let me show you some shit. Ready to work, BD. BD1 is the best little guy. Uh, like one of the best things about this game, and in this game in particular. 
you can customize the hell out of them and you can swap out little like face and body parts and stuff and you get like full like color customization uh and like material customization so my personal favorite is the uh bd astro uh lenses um and then yeah and then you can you can like customize all his different like materials and then like material colors and it's just it's, it's so good it's so fucking good so this is my bd one um and he truly is a perfect little guy look at him <laughs> he's so cute he's amazing um and then Good also this is a cool this. thing this, this is a cool thing you can do uh when you're like in the game itself um if you hold down uh if you hold down on the d-pad for a second you can just like check in with uh with beanie one hey buddy <laughs> and he just has like little voice lines like hiya bd it's so cute anyway all right so we just came down to the basement uh currently our goal is to go to sleep uh but before we do so are you a star wars fan by any chance um actually <laughs> i i've talked about this a lot i'm not gonna spend a lot of time on this because i sound like a broken record um less than you might think i'm actually not a huge star wars fan I, I am mostly a passive observer of Star Wars in, like, the film and TV space. Um, but Star Wars video games, I go crazy for. S Star Wars is essentially a video game franchise to me. <laughs> like, like, and, and I'm almost not kidding. Gris always had a green thumb. You know he talks to his plants? I am not an ex Star Wars enjoyer. I am still a Star Wars enjoyer. I am just not. I wouldn't say I'm an active Star Wars fan. I I will enjoy a piece of Star Wars media every so often. Not as much recently, ayo. But like you know. Whoa. My old scrapper outfit. Oh shit! No way. <gasps> no I kidding. Know. Oh, cool! And it's got different colors, too, now. That's awesome. It's his old one. It's his old one. Guys, it's the one from the other one. That's so cool. Okay, awesome. Creepy. Creamy. What are you scanning? Helix set. wonder why it ended up here. Wait, what? Helix set. This seven-stringed halic set once belonged to the Jedi Seer Junda, who composed music with it. Using psychometry, Cal was also able- Oh, this thing! This thing! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, right. I kind- Yeah, I kind of remember this thing. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> look, at the, look at that thing trying to- Trying to decide whether it wants to uh, be occlusion cold or not. You see that? <laughs> like when you- <laughs> It's like, oh god, the FOV is tightening. Do I, do I leave? Do I stay? Oh, I don't know. It's like, no, I can still see you. Get back out there. Um, what's this? Hobo's pretty far from the nearest trade route. Looks like Grease makes do with salvage. Okay. Boop, boop, boop. All right, that's, uh... Let's check this out later. Yeah, that's basically really everything. Need some rest. Let's sleep. That is the thing we need to do. Here's, here's my prediction. We are going to get a, a crazy um, either force dream that prophesies some shit or a trauma dream that leaves us uh, sensitive and in, in, in dire straits with our inner turmoil. And then we're going to wake up and be like, oh shit, get back to work and not talk about it. He's gonna have a dream about everybody dying <laughs> on the mission. No, I didn't say horse dream. What? No, he's not. Oh god, he's gonna dream about uh, Grease. <laughs> guess some things never change. Damn it. Weirdo. Hairball. <laughs> Aww. Uh, 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 Fucking Grease jump scare. Thanks for letting scare. me crash here. Of course. Why do you think I've kept your stuff around all these years? I was hoping you'd stop by and maybe take a break. You both Aww. know what happens when I stay in one place too long. You said there's a spare gyro around here somewhere? 
We've got plenty. Oh uh, yeah, I got one in my dual sense. You are what I want to talk about. I'm fine. The sooner we get moving, the better. Oh wow! Go oh, y'all remember last time when I was like, he's he's seeming like he's trying to maybe like play up his his cool factor a little bit. It doesn't feel natural. I think they're like going into that. Trouble with Saw Guerrera? Maybe. Yeah, one of us has to keep fighting. That's funny. That's the exact same thing you said the day we all split up. Yeah, because I. Yeah, because. It... Oh, disappointed Grease face. I know you all had your reasons for leaving. But walking away isn't an option for me. I have to hold the line. And where's that gun, you cow? Look, I wish things were different, but you keep losing people. And you yourself said that the Empire is growing stronger every day. Now, maybe it's time for you to be something more than a lightsaber. Think about yourself. Settle down. Find a home. What? A home, Grease. There is no home. Home was the Order. It was my teacher. It was everyone I lost. What does their sacrifice mean if I go and I just give up and stick my head in the sand? I know you were dealt a bad hand, but you got to take it from me. Somebody who had to learn the hard way. You gotta know when to walk away from a rigged game. Otherwise, you are gonna end up losing something you could never replace. It's good. It's pretty good. All right. I want to show you something. He just pulls out a figurine of Hatsune Miku. <laughs> this is a smuggler's tunnel. It came with the cantina. Oh, no kidding. Now you go ahead and look. I keep a lot of spare parts down there. I'm sure you'll be able to find whatever you need to get the manis up and running. Thanks. I appreciate all this. Kyle, can I tell you one thing? It's really good seeing you again. Oh. <laughs> yeah, you too. Stop that right now. You're not allowed. Grease. I've decreed it. I'll think about what you said. Hey, uh, watch your step down there. Be careful. I definitely have a pest problem. <laughs> That's so cute. Okay. Awesome. Great cutscene. Find the Euro module. Don't mind if I do. The Mantis. It's systems failing. Oh, it's a little quest summary. That helps. That's really, really good. Uh, Jackhammer and uh, DK Wild, thank you for the sub and the resub. I appreciate it. Uh, okay, cool, awesome. Yeah, that's that's fine. We we understand. We just saw that go down. Um. All right. Yeah. Let's 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 go for it. Let's go on ahead. Whoa. All right. I'm wondering, okay, listen, I know, I know pink is my brand, but I don't, I don't feel like it's Cal's brand, you know? Can I be honest? Like, let's mix it up. Like, I'm not, you know, if I were, if I were playing, uh, Jedi Penny, it would be one thing, but I'm not, I'm playing Cal Kestis. So I'm like, I'm wondering, is he like an orange? Is he maybe a green? He kind of strikes me as a green. Maybe, uh... I kind of like the idea of an orange. Um, <laughs> me looking at my uh, fruit basket. Um, also, what's the what's the new stuff? I have, I have no fucking clue what I have that is new! The streamer is asking what is new! Well, what did you tell her? I told her I would ask! Rebel hero, hermit, at the Paul. Yeah, that's all correct. What's what's new? Oh, the hermit's really good. What's new? <laughs> oh, I got new materials. Oh my god, it's I'm so silly. 
That's what's new. Understood. Okay. This one's All interesting. Right. What new materials? Let's go, uh, you go well capped a little bit? Nah. Nah, I just, I love that. That gold sheen. This is Pete customization UI? No, it's so fucking good. It is so good. Oh, right, we got light metal. What's, um... What are our options for light metal on the secondary colors? Ooh, that silver alloy is pretty nice. The brush Durastil also has a nice look to it. But honestly, I'm still loving that, uh, the bronzium. I can't... I can't say anything else is really speaking to me nearly as much as that. Um... The accent color... However, maybe that could be a dunium or a brush durasteel. I don't know. I, and now, actually, now that I'm looking at it, I do. I don't like this. I don't like this grip. <laughs> I changed my mind. I think I'm gonna. Oh yeah. Oh, that's the good stuff. Okay. Now, what about um? What about the primary material? We weren't... Ooh, hold on. I mean, I, I love the wood. I love the wood, right? Like, I, like that's extremely good. And if we get some other non-metals, I am definitely going to be taking a look at those. But in terms of metals... Oh, brush to our steel. Stainless Durasteel. The silver alloy is really good. This is the most, like, bougie lightsaber anyone's ever invented. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, and then if we... What if we did, like, the... Like, a different accent color. Ooh! What if the accents were the non-metals? That looks... Okay, that looks dumb. <laughs> that one looks stupid. Oh, but the Coruscant Pale Coral? Or the Coruscant Blue-Gray? Or maybe the... Could get Bronzium on the accents and the grips. That's actually a pretty good look. Where's, where's the Bronzium? That's a pretty good look. I will not lie. I kind of like that. Then match him up. Oh, man. Oh, baby. That's... Hey, this lightsaber was designed by Apple in California. Seems durable, <laughs> right? Did I still not see... Why is it... Okay, it, it wasn't telling me it's new anymore. It okay. great. Oh yeah. Oh, he's an he's an orange saber kind of guy. You cannot tell me he's Look at this. Look at that. I think it's just because he has red hair. But this feels right. Okay. Smuggler's tunnels. Old smuggling tunnels, huh? Green's That's what I said. Kept a few secrets up his sleeve. Or below his basement, more accurately. Ah, yeah. Where's Turgle? That's the question we've been asking for centuries now. Only just recently answered by EA and Respawn Entertainment. Um, unfortunately, we cannot go up to see Turgle just yet. Or at least I don't think we could. Maybe we could have exited after resting, but I know before resting, it was like, hey, you can't leave. You have to go to sleep, bitch. And I was like, don't call me that. And it said, um, okay. This is Star Wars. It's not for women. I was like, what are you talking about? It was a weird conversation. I would recommend maybe not talking to this guy anymore. Uh-oh. You okay? Boglings. Are these what spooked Grease? You're okay, bud. Have you been spooking Grease down here? <laughs> yes. Don't worry. I won't hurt you. 
The creature's fine. Can you? Okay. All right. Y'all need to quit that. <laughs> and that's how you get through. You just jump in front of the... Whoop! Leave me alone. <laughs> no, you too! You leave me alone also. I'm not interested, fucker. Here, what am I looking at here? Okay, seems relatively linear. Yeah, shit is like right here. This is not a very big level, it seems. Nice level, Jedi survivor. Not very big, it seems. Careful around here, bud. Nobody's used these tunnels for a long time now. Oh! Can't miss that. Unavailable in combat. Oh, God! <laughs> I'm in combat? <laughs> Right, I forgot there are monsters down here. You may ask me, how? And I say, don't talk to me. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. How is this happening? Probably fine. Let's check it out. No, <laughs> let's check this out. The Metroid Prime map? I know. I mean, again, that first game was essentially just Metroid Prime with uh, with Souls light combat instead of FPS shooting. Woohoo! And uh, this is also that, but like a little bit bigger. This is actually, uh, this is kind of like the structure, at least in this map, um, it kind of has like the branching off from the hub world structure of like the recent God of War games, uh, which is fine by me. Cause That's those games abandoned. rule. More scraps, huh? Leave it to Grease to take another person's junk and add more junk. Oh, Cal. You have such a fun understanding of the world and the commentary. Pristine. Hello, I'm on the other side. Don't try this at home. Leave it to Grease. He's a little. <laughs> He's a little guy. He's as grumpy as a fly. A fly that cannot fly. His name is Grease. We'll have to find another way around. Crazy money. Let me guess. More prospecting equipment. Is there anyone on Kobo who isn't digging for scraps? A gyro! Gimme, gimme. Is that it? Yuck. Rusted and shitty. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh! Not good, not good. Oh shit! Oh my god, this is really bad. <laughs> it is worse than I even thought. Oh, looks like we're not seeing Turtle anytime soon. Bye, Cal. Sweet dreams. Never look when you can leap, hey? Nice one. Uh, zing! The sooner we get to Greece, the sooner we can. We should check Ooh. this out. Oh! Oh! What's this? Okay. The hell am I looking at? You let your dog up his leisure for five seconds and suddenly, uh oh, hashtag caven. Hashtag ow my back. Cannot fast travel. I wonder why. Okay. Let's, uh, let's throw this skill point in here.
good lord. Trying to trying to pick what skills I want to grab is like a real problem. <laughs> Automatically evade. Ah, oh, it's pretty good. Greater confusion. Ooh. Confuse multiple enemies with one go. That's really good. That seems pretty useful. It also increase the amount of time. Didn't we get this already? Oh no, because I need two. While holding an enemy with pull, press triangle to pull and hold a second target. No kidding. Oh my god. Uh wow, okay. Jesus. I don't, I don't know what to do. I guess improve footwork. Let, let's just let's just keep going with the fundamentals here. We we, we just need to stick with the basics for now cuz I need to I need to figure out like how often I'm going to be using all of these other abilities cuz I have them, but I sure as hell haven't been using them. Time to move. Almost reminds me of the Jedi training grounds. Yeah. It feels different. Older. That was not the. Oh shit! Oh, I was supposed to run across there. It seems obvious looking at it now, but sometimes I'm just like, is this a, is this a decoration wall? No, anything that has like that horizontal, like scratch look to it, I need to recognize that is a wall run. At least they let me do that. That could have been disastrous otherwise. I would have had to briefly reset from a previous checkpoint. Can you imagine? Whoa, 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 okay. We're doing this now, and now we're doing this. <laughs> Sick. What is this place? What is this place? That was, uh, <laughs> that was Chris Pratt Mario in the first Mario teaser. Hmm. Well done. Disaster. Huge masses of rock fell through the roof and slammed into the subterranean sanctuary, indicating intense seismic activity above ground. Huh. Okay. Mushroom Kingdom, here we come. Realizing now that, like, you, you gotta wonder, is the reason that line, like, why would they put that fucking line in the trailer, in that first trailer, it's not even used in the final cut, and it's like the worst thing he has ever said as Mario. It's like an awful first impression, and it's not even in the movie. He never says that. <laughs> like, they like they just ad-libbed that in the trailer edit for some reason. <laughs> like, like literally, now, now it kind of makes more sense as to why it sounds as bad as it does, because they probably just like called him up on Zoom at some point, and they were like, Hey Chris, can you uh can you get a little bit of a like a pickup line for this trailer real quick? I don't know if you're at your studio. And he was like, no, it's fine. I got my phone on me. And they were like, okay, cool. Here, why don't you say Mushroom Kingdom? Here we come for the first teaser trailer. And he was like, oh, okay, like this Mushroom Kingdom. Here we come, like that. And they were like, yep, okay, we got it. He's like, wait, what? That wasn't my take. And they were like, oh no, we got it. We're good. Oh, oh my god, that looks so cool. <laughs> what the fuck? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on just a second. I need to go back. This is this is the way I play these games, is I'll I'll see that there's a branching path. So instead of picking one and committing to it until the like logical endpoint of that pathway, I will instead inch my way through each of them. Uh, <laughs> alternatively, I will go. I'll go to one, do a bit of progress, then go back to the other one. <laughs> Be like, hey, I do this too. Same. Okay, I'm glad I'm not alone in that. Also, what the frickin' fuck? I guess that wasn't anything. I well, I guess we'll probably unlock something that goes right here. I don't know. Let's go back. Wee. Star Wars Kingdom, here we come. 
Darth Vader Kingdom. Here we come. Why did Penny curse him with the man bun? Because he's a software developer. Careful, BD. That's his. No, that's his first time. Stop. Oh, hello. Whoa. I'm sorry it has come to this. That's a cool outfit. Will it be a complete memory purge? No. Only what the council demanded. Then at least I shall remember you. I am ready. Uh oh. Are you lying? What is your name, droid? I am ZNA4, of course. How may I serve the order? Z. Tell me how to navigate the Kobo Abyss. What the hell? I have no information on that in my memory banks. Master Kree. You are aware the Republic has issued a full-scale evacuation order. I am. Um... That is why I have a very important task for you, Z. Take this. A tuner? Oh, what a fine model. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, a tuner? <laughs> Use that to open the forest array. Travel underground. Stop for no one. That is an order, Z. Am I not coming with you? No. The key to Tanalor is in that array. If you do not hurry, I fear it will be lost forever. May the Force be with you. High Republic Jedi robes, book readers keep winning. I was going to say, this has to be some, like, extended universe shit. This is wild. This is, like, a completely different vibe than anything I've, like, ever seen. <laughs> I think this droid has been here for hundreds of years. Nope! I have not. I've only been here for oh, AG7. Something's very wrong. Is your name Z? Yes, it is. How do you... Oh, no! I'm... Oh, the animation's so good. I'm Cal. This is BD. We're gonna help you. Pleasure to meet you both. Some help would be most appreciated. Appreciated. <laughs> oh. All right, we got you, Z. DNA for Z. Z is a droid from the High Republic era. This is crazy. I like. I know literally like next to, if not exactly, nothing about. The, the whole High Republic era. Like, this is a completely new vibe for me. Uh, tasked by Jedi Master Santari Kree to recover the key to Tanalor, she immediately takes to Cal, although she questions his unconventional attire. I assume she's about to do so. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's help you out here. What are we looking at? For a second, I thought I got excited. I thought she was going to be an Iron Knight. Uh, what is that? I don't know what that is. High Republic is around 200 years before the main saga. That's fucking awesome. <laughs> I legitimately, I love that shit. Also, hold on. I gotta like... Uh, one sec. I do some quick change to my monitor real quick. Nope. <laughs> okay, I just thought I thought I'd test that. What am I? Die. Oh. Oh. Wait. 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 Do I just like 
Can I... Okay, I can't grab that. So there must be another thing I can... Activate this with, I guess. Iron Knights were droids that fuse with sentient, force-sensitive crystals. It was in a couple uh, Legends books, and I'm sad it's non-canon now because it's a fun idea. That does sound fucking awesome. That sounds really cool. Sorry, I'm like completely stumped. <laughs> hold on, hold on. Oh! Oh, that is all that I have to do. Okay. Well then... Not completely, Z. I'm a Jedi, all right. But you're not even no, 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 no. I'm more of a poncho guy. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, he's a poncho guy. Well, this is a problem now because wait. Oh yeah, and they and they know that's a problem. They were like, no, you can't do that, idiot. To how are you gonna get across? And I was like, I'm just experimenting. And they said, you're stupid. And I said, don't call me that. And they said, what? Oh my god, I could just grab it from over here. It's my bad. Maybe I couldn't grab it because I was standing on the platform that it would immediately dissolve now that I think about it. Let's see. Listen, I, I know that ponchos are like an important part of Cal Kestis' character. But I had cannon that they're not, okay? Use the orbs to activate the bridge, then you can reach the crane controls. Uh, yeah, no kidding. I think I'll just so many idle years who really knows. This droid's got more than a screw loose. What was that? I uh said hold tight, Z. <laughs> okay now. Do do zero gravity. Do zero I don't know what these things do, but they Oh, they're not coming from the... Oh, that's a that's a barrier. I thought they were like some weird... Activators. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm sorry. I'm gonna fall. Wow, that actually worked. You're wrong, Penny. You're not invited to my birthday party anymore saying that. Um, okay. I didn't want to go anyway. Sorry for being... I keep forgetting that. Sorry for being correct. Soon, Z. Take your time. I've only been hint here for a while. Hmm. I don't have your name in my data banks. When did you pass the trials? Never took them. I was knighted in the field. And what was the reason for this flagrant breach of protocol? It's a long story. <laughs> oh. All right. What do we get? What do we get? New hair? Darn. Just some Jedi paint. <laughs> Damn. And th this whole, this whole like, grab a big cable with like a, like a plug in it and like plug it into the other thing. Weirdly satisfying. I think it's just because how big it is in his hands. Like he looks like a little action figure. <laughs> just like carrying it around like, oh, and now I have to plug it into the wall socket. To turn Andy's lamp on. Thank you, Cal. Don't mention it. Uh-oh. <laughs> I love her. Uh, this game's got some look? incredible side characters so far. Oh, no! Yeah, this is, like, honestly... The side characters are kind of what's making this game so far. Oh, a planet hidden within the cobalt base. Mm, it's home to 
to a Jedi temple. A bastion of the Order's light on the galactic frontier. At least that's what my master hoped Talon might become. Her animations are so good! I should do it for now. Just gotta figure a way out of this place. Well, I can help with that. It's this... Was it that? No. Oh! <laughs> yes, it is this way. Follow me. Aww. Oh, now I see where we are. A meditation chamber. Master Kree designed these to train <gasps> Jedi. Please, arena. Don't recall what it does, however. Arena Master mode. Had a brilliant mind. Do you know her, Cal? Can't say I do. No matter. But I think she would have liked you. Aww. I sincerely hope this is like introducing an arena mode. Oh my god, I would. I would kill for it. Yeah. You could have been down here forever. New perk, resilience. What does that mean? Oh, you've discovered a perk. Different types of perks can be found throughout the game and can change the way you play significantly. I'll be the judge of that. You start with three available perk slots. More slots can be unlocked as you progress. Especially powerful perks may require multiple slots. Perks can be viewed at any time in the perk section of the abilities menu. Currently equipped perks can be managed at meditation points. Cool. Um. Yeah, so like ever since I played the Ratchet and Clank games, I am a sucker for arena modes in like any game. So I'm I'm really hoping cuz the way she described it seemed very like Ruby, that planet you I mentioned. Don't know. What's it like? Tanalo? Oh, what a wondrous place. How do I get there? Navigate the Kobo That must be the knowledge your master purged from your memory banks. Well, That's like Hollow Knight charms. Still not played that. I will. Eventually. Hey, he's gonna see Bloody Palace and DMC one day and flip. I'll hold you to that. Whoa! Now we're back. I guess I guess no arena mode. Damn. My arena mode instincts are always incorrect. <laughs> but one day. You were nice to me on. one time. <laughs> I'll be there in a moment, Cal. Don't wait on my behalf. She's just oh, like me for real, for real. Such strange buildings. Oh my, what is that? What is what? What is that thing? Oh, that's the homophobic slug. His name is Claude. <laughs> All right, well, where to? Um, we have a we have a rumor to follow up on. Doma's outpost commodities. Oh, bring the gyro module to Greece. I'm wondering if could we do the rumor now, or would it? Do, do we want to bring Z along with us for that? Wait, I don't think she's actually. Oh, she's not actually tagging along. Okay, we have a moment. Um, so I think I actually want to go and do this this rumor. Uh, yeah. Oh, you can hold for rumor details? That's really good. Find the missing prospectors. Uh, they're out of their box. According to a Kobo local, several prospectors went to inspect a nearby cave. Haven't been seen in some time. Uh, there's long been speculation about what exactly lurks in the cave, so it would be worth checking that they're okay. All right. Let's do that. Um... can't tell where I'm supposed to be going. I know it's not this. Let's go ahead and uh take that beacon off. Man, they gotta listen. I'm not exactly like a waypoint fanatic, but sometimes they help. 
I feel like this this hub world is big enough that they should be showing me waypoints or something. At least custom ones on the uh on just like the standard uh camera. At least as an option. Whoa! That was funny. He landed in a funny way. Why'd there are multiple worlds, yes. I don't like you and you don't like me. That's right. But you annoy me a lot less than the others in this go-nowhere town. And I think you feel the same. What are you saying? Out with it already. I'm saying this is a date. And we're on it. <gasps> and if you don't Damn. Like it, too bad. Haha! <laughs> gotcha! The fucking gay agenda strikes again! <laughs> Okay. This is where we go. I wonder if I can. Woo! Oh, cool. Oh, what a cool uh, way to enter. I guess. I guess this is like the equivalent of a fucking dungeon. There's so much stuff to do in this, on this planet. Oh, Count yourself lucky you can't smell. The sodden grotto. <laughs> Oh, shit. No kidding. Dude. We found where they make Redditors. Whoa. <laughs> Damn. Why do I keep... Look, right here. <laughs> I keep doing this. Why am I like this? That was karma. What was that? There's a indicator. I guess not. Whoa! Whoa! What the hell are you? Stop! 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 You're freaking me out! What? Hold on, hold on. Scan these motherfuckers. The Bramlick? <laughs> Whoa! Ah, it's me, the Bramlick. Not overly aggressive, but painful to touch. Dispatch safely from afar or avoid. Literally evil tumbleweed with teeth. When approached, the spines that cover a uh, Bramlick's entire spherical body extend outwards, deterring all threats. Uh, as such, they are known as spikers by the locals. They're easily dispatched, but they are most mostly content to let strangers be if they are in turn left in peace. What are you talking about? Those motherfuckers started chasing me down. Uh, lies. Propaganda. Fucking <laughs> Bramlick propaganda. They tried to kill me immediately upon sight. <laughs> like a fucked up emoji. Hey, they were just trying to give you a hug? Yeah, with knives! If I, if I, if I came up and stabbed you in the stomach, could I just be like, Oh, haha, you, you received my special high five. Like, no! You're dying now. <laughs> That's how it works. You can't just say yes, yes, yeah, yes, okay? You don't believe that. If there's one thing I can't stand in this world is people who wish wash and don't actually believe in it. What are you doing? He's doing a little dance. Go, 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 go. Damn it, he stopped. 
You ruined the bit. Now he goes. Okay. He's digging. Wait, hold on. Oh, I just realized we can scan from See that? BD's thing. That's cool. The scavenger droid. Whoa! Reconnaissance. Skittish runs at the slightest threat. I fucking love how many creatures and robots and fun guys there are in this game. Resist anything but physical attacks by digging to escape. These an these anxious uh anx anxious I oh I so I can't say the word ancient correctly, but I also can't say anxious when it's actually how you're supposed to say it. What is wrong with me? These anxious, greedy droids are a familiar sight wherever there is abandoned material up for grabs. Though to have been originally or thought to have been originally created to bring valuable scrap to their owners. These droids now roam independently, hoarding whatever valuables they can find with their grubby mechanical hands. This game is so fun to read all the creature entries in. Are you asleep or dead? These creatures were killed by blasters. Oh shit, fire. dead, okay. Let's try. <laughs> oh, he's just gonna, just gonna run. Yeah, no worries. I can leave y'all on. I will come this way though. No. No, 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 no. See, what are you talking about? They leave people alone. What are you talking about? Oh, you can parry them though. That's cool. Unavailable in combat. I literally have to kill them. They're sitting here like, oh, they'll leave you alone if you don't, if you don't mess with them. That's literally not true. I just tried. I'm still unavailable in combat. What are you talking about? Is it still you? Bye. Sorry. Oh, scrapyard legs. Love that. Love that for us. Okay, we can just go. All right. Holy shit, this is like, this is becoming expansive. <laughs> Much like this video game at $70? Give me a break! In this economy? <laughs> Shortcut? Yes. Just what kind of creature lives down here? Massive rib cage. Okay. That's not so good. A little bit ominous. A little bit weird, but. Look at this rib cage. Think the Bedlam Raiders would pay for fossils? Should I buy this oh, game? No. Um. Gotta be one of the missing prospectors, buddy. Oh dear. Um, it's too early to say, for sure. I'm still, like, so early in the game. Um, I would say right now, probably not. Like, you know, unless you can you can play on PS5 and you are absolutely fine with playing in 30 FPS, um, then there's basically no reason to try playing, like, any of the other modes, and especially not on uh, PC. P P like if you can only get it on PC, it's it's a no go. Like just from the start until they fix the shit. Uh, but on PS5, it's it's mostly fine in quality mode. Uh, the block meter is increased. That's cool. I'll take that. What 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 am I looking at here? Oh, one one to three slots in use, and this is the collection on the side. Okay, cool. Noted. 
Let's rest up. Is there more training I can do? Damn it. <laughs> I want an arena! Give me an arena! I want to fight. I want to kill. I want to eat a pickled dill. This seems like a boss arena. <laughs> what do you know? <laughs> Talons. Uh-oh. 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 Hi. It's nice to see you. Rancor. Okay. That's new. Whoa, 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 whoa. I just almost died immediately. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Stop! No, oh my god, no, let me go! Don't eat me! No! What the fuck? I... Sorry, I was hungry. I... Okay. I can't relate. If I was hungry, I simply would not. Oh my god with this guy. Oh my god with this guy. Okay. Let me get my force stuff. Whee! <laughs> oh, come on, man! Holy shit, he's insane. No, no, no. Okay, all right. This is fine, this is fine. Okay, can't throw. No, come on, man. What am I supposed to do about that? That is an instant kill? Like, no matter what, bro? Oh my god! Just don't get hit? Yeah, good point. Here, what if- what if I try, um... Could try changing my stances, I guess. Oh, do I have to change that at a... Meditation point? Yeah, I think so. Holy shit! Okay, uh, let's try... I don't think double bladed is really gonna make a difference here. Yeah, power and speed. Let's go for dual blade. All right. Hello. Let's try again. Oh my god, right away. Okay. This is feeling like maybe a try this later kind of fight. I, it's he just demolishes me. I feel like I can do it though Like I feel like I was I don't know I was I feel like I was getting close enough that one time If I can just be like so careful like almost like Walking on eggshells eggshells careful There is no fucking way his reach is insane And that is an instant kill. That it, it clearly. I can't and I can't get out. I am pressing every button. <laughs> yeah, this is clearly like this is an optional fight. Um, I'm wondering like how the hell am I supposed to do this? Literally, I I think I might just have to come back. Like if I can't get it in the next like couple attempts, this is a comeback later kind of fight. Yeah, no. <laughs> Look at that! To block attacks from any direction. Okay, I should... Maybe I could try parrying a little more. Not when he does that! Holy... 
Holy shit. Stop dying the rank or get too full and be sad. Good! I hope he suffers. I hope he eats me so much and he feels awful about himself in the morning. Oh, wait, shit, hold on. Well, not quiet. <laughs> no way! No way. Kinda hate how lightsabers are just glowing swords in the games. That's literally what they are. <laughs> like, that's... That is quite literally down to the very definition of what the name lightsaber means. <laughs> they are a saber of light. that time holy fuck okay that was a good one who actually okay i need to need to lock in i think they mean as and they don't really burn through things like a laser would like okay like i i do know what you mean i was i was joking a little bit i know what you're getting at but also i think at a certain point it's just like what do you expect <laughs> like well to be fair also on top of that this game does improve that like, you can literally, like, you, like, the, in this game, you will straight up be, like, cutting limbs off and shit. That, like, that is a thing in this one. But then, like, before now, that's, like, a straight up, that's, like, an insane, that's, like, a resource hog. And at a certain point, you gotta have higher, like, game design priorities than dismemberment, as cool as it is. I had I had one really good go at it that's gonna sustain me for the next like 45 minutes of trying this. So strap in. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, I miss Turgle. I wonder where Turgle is right now. I wonder what Turgle's doing. Deal. Oh my god. Holy fuck. It's just he can just demolish me. Penny Parker's patented basher face against the wall technique will prevail. I, I I'm the most unreasonably stubborn. Like I don't have to I don't have to do this. I can come back when I am like for sure strong enough to do it. But I got so close one time. Can I ask who Turgle is, or do I just need to see to believe? You'll find out, hopefully. I don't actually know if we're gonna see Turgle again, but if we do, I'm I'm cer I'm almost certain you will understand immediately. Either that, or just watch the last stream. Buddy. Fuck. I wonder, okay. You can still parry with dual blade, right? I feel like I should be able to parry some of these attacks, but maybe that's maybe that's too much to ask given how big this guy is. Oh, it 
uses force with dual blade. That makes sense. Oh shit, so maybe single blade is the way to go. Okay, no, no, no. Oh, oh. Help, BD. Shit, no, come on. No! Damn. We're so close. Okay, I think I have, I think I have a strategy. I have a strategy. I'm gonna single blade for most of the fight, but then when either he stumbles for an extended period of time or when I can slow down with the force, I'll dual blade and just wail into him. And then past that point, it is a matter of being able to dodge and, and parry correctly. Shit. Damn. That's a problem. <laughs> okay. I can do this one. I, can, I literally, I can feel it. It's harder than it needs to be. But I can do it. I, yeah, I have three chances to heal during this fight, so I need to be, like, super careful. Come on. Okay, back up, back up. Don't get stingy. We can make this an endurance test. Shit. It's okay. Oh my god! Yeah, okay. The the red attacks, I mean, we know this already, but non-negotiable in terms of being able to be hit by them. It, it's just a non-starter. There's no no room for error on those. I have to just fucking run. Shit. Okay, stomp attacks do not seem like they can be parried. Either that or I was just too busy attacking. We're getting closer. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry that I'm doing this and not just waiting until I'm stronger. This is who I am. <laughs> that was bad. Holy fuck. Just got slam jammed immediately. He came in and said, let's do this. Oh. Holy fuck! That double swipe! What is going on? <laughs> no way! Back up, back up. Back up, back up, back up. Woo! Oh! No, 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 no. Oh shit. Help me, BD. No, no, no. BD. Okay. Super careful, super careful. Okay, wrong angle. 
I was expecting like an under sweep. <laughs> okay. All right. Ah! We're so close. We're so close. Tantalizingly close on that one. No fucking way did you start with that attack! I hate this! It, there's literally no surviving it, and now we have proven as an irrefutable fact, at least at our current level, that is an instantaneous demise, no matter what, just regardless of what happens. Oh yeah, he can just decide to do that, I guess. It's okay. Bad start. It's okay. We can recover. Throw it. You know, for that attack, I feel like I should... I should... I should... I guess I'm dead now. <laughs> it doesn't matter anymore. Okay, for the... For, like, the shockwave attack, I'm feeling like following up immediately with a lightsaber throw, like saving the lightsaber throws for the follow-up attack because there's a window right after he does that shockwave attack um, where I can attack him without him retaliating. But the problem is that it takes so long to run up to him after that that the attack window is almost immediately like shortened to almost nothing. to get out un unless i am like missing something crucial he literally faked me out this guy is insane i love this don't get me wrong i'm very much enjoying this i cannot stand how early and how often he is doing that attack now The plan is falling apart. It's okay. It's okay. Don't stress. Here we go. This is the one. was just straight up the end of the mission this. we were doing. I did right have to do that. Doorstep. Oh my god, that was so fun. <laughs> okay, all right, awesome. Amazing. Now let me grab this. <laughs> Please be as like a stim increase. <clears throat> Shatter. Oh, new perk. Okay. I will take it. Oh my god, I like I need a second. Oh my god, that was so fun. Woohoo! Take a look at what Shatter does. And rest. I wonder will the will the Rancor respawn? Okay, what is Shatter? Up on 
block meter damage. Attacks are more effective at breaking enemies guard. Love that. We only have two, so we might as well equip them both. Beautiful. And we have two skill points, which means there was something with two skill points I wanted to see. Oh my god, seven skills ready for force. Holy shit. What was the thing I wanted to... Oh yeah, confounded mind. Um, is there anything else I would rather... Cal recovers additional life when using a stim canister from BD1. That would be pretty cool. <laughs> Not gonna lie. What about um some double-bladed lightsaber attacks? Hold L1, then press square to attack and leap backwards, creating distance from the target. It's pretty good. Gathering Tempest. You know what? I'm gonna be getting lightsaber attacks. <laughs> Stormtrooper on an armor display. That's so funny. I really like that. And backstep slash. Cool. Uh, okay. Try that out for a second. How does that work? Oh, sick. That's really cool. That doesn't cost force or any that doesn't cost force or anything. That's just something we can do. That kill cutscene was so rewarding. It really, really was. Um, I need to see what's over here, and then we are good to bounce. Come on. There we go. Boing, you know it. If I had just chosen to go this other way first, it would have solved all my problems. Whoa! God damn it! No! <laughs> Get away! Die! I can't stand these guys! <laughs> I'm dead. What's this? Oh, let me just catch my breath. Gotta be a way out. Uh, somewhere. Been here a while. You. <laughs> the missing prospectors. They sounded like they were kidding. <laughs> they sounded like they were joking. Am I wrong? <laughs> like, that was not serious. There's gotta be a way out. Somewhere. Sorry, I don't mean to be mean. That's too mean, I apologize. But also, it was, uh, it was kind of funny. That sounded like, that sounded like the force was tricking him. <laughs> he must have died here. Then from like behind the force veil, they're just like. <laughs> Keep going on your mean arc? No! I choose to be nice. And it's a choice that we should all make. How the hell do I get back? Oh, I see. Then again, we did just uh, hit 666,000 subscribers on Snapcube uh, the other day. So like, if there ever was a time to be mean and devilish, it would be now. But also, no. At least not when I'm not kidding. <laughs> I, I posted that that funny funny art of of Devil Penny being like, I don't feel anything different. But it's not me, not really. How do I get back? How do I get back? Oh, this. It's literally as easy as that. Force All right. The force is with me. 
We cannot fast travel. Never mind. The force stinks. We're just back here again? What is going on? Oh my god, this is a nightmare. Oh, I got way too confused. I got really, really confused. This is the shortcut. We go back this way. And we come this way. And that is the way back. Holy fuck. Senior eye makes me very happy, by the way. Thank you. Uh, it makes me happy to do it. I'm glad that people are enjoying it. Ooh, my eyes. Alrighty. What's next? Kobo is only 12% completed, by the way, if you look up at the top there. Um, kind of insane. All of this shit we can go back and do, and then there's, like, a bunch of, like, branching paths down here, and I'm sure literally everywhere. Oh, yeah, this game is, like, big, big, and you have to remember, this is, this is one planet. Like, we're gonna go to other places. And I don't know how many of them are gonna be as big as this. This definitely seems kind of like their... Their kind of big showcase, like, hub world. But from what I understand... Even the more, like, standard kind of Metroidvania-style levels... Uh, are still bigger than the first game. Hunter's Quarry. I just I just want to I just want to find more customization stuff. I'm not going to lie. The the customization in this game is so in depth and it's like really kind of like captured me. Ooh. A little a little cove, a little divot we can explore. What is in here? Is this a cove or a divot? This is a series of games, yes. Um, or I guess more like a duology. Um, this is the second one. What the hell? What the hell? What the hell? Oh, it's you. Not what I meant to do. I'll take it. Here. Uh, mind trick. I can't. You don't have a brain. You're a creature. Yeah, I don't know what what's wrong with these guys. I was not even messing with them. Yes, that works. You don't have a, a lots of um you don't have a brain you're a creature me one. IRL or that's what people tell me jokes guys just so you know just so that we can kind of exist in solidarity in this place I was gonna say after I was gonna follow when I said that I was gonna follow it up with god I wish that were me so we're kind of covering all of our bases here I'll check it out which is nice the wise hunters Bomber jacket, bomber jacket, bomber jacket, bomber jacket, bomber jacket. Whoa! With the midriff cut? Bro. The bomber jacket with the midriff cut? Say it ain't so, cow. Say it ain't so, cow. So, cow? Whoa. Something just happened. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god, this is a look. This is a look!
Do we bring the beard back? Yes, we do. Hold on. Oh, the survivor pants are what I was going for. Even better. Like, what color palette do I want? This is pretty good. Oh, man. This kind of goes hard. I feel like it, it needs a little bit of refinement, but it does kind of go hard. I think I want to try... Yeah, okay. And then I think I want to change the shirt also again. And then I think we get the the shirt color and style down. It'll be perfect. Oh? Oh. I mean like yeah. Right? It's kinda hidden. He's looking pretty sick with it. Oh my god, it looks so cool! Also, listen, I know we've been like kind of joking and goofing on the bun. I do actually genuinely unironically really like it. Just so you know, just so you know kind of where I stand. This combo kind of slaps for me. look at it in daylight oh my god it's even better it's perfect this looks awesome oh my god i'm really loving this game i'm so glad we've made it to this point all right let's um i guess let's circle back around to that platform up there There's a lot of stuff we, like, can't interact with, but I want to see if there's something we can interact with. Whoa, what's going on? Oh, raiders. And raiders and robots. Straw swords. Hello, Alexa. <laughs> they literally... Everything from the pitch of the voice to the delivery of that line to the writing of that line reminded me exactly of like classic 80s Simon from Alvin and the Chipmunks. Just run the scan, Alvin. I think we need to run the scan for hostiles. But everything is hostile. Just run the scan, Theodore. <laughs> Am I wrong? I don't know how I don't know how much this is hitting for for anyone else. Yeah, no, if women are oppressed, why did I try to kill you? I'm sorry, I wasn't thinking. This always happens. Don't worry, Queen. All is forgiven. If women are oppressed, then why... Simon. Oh, we can interact with something here. Whoa. People Don't fall behind, BD1. Oh, nice. What is it, buddy? A gift revoked. The others dig too much. They damage the cubes. Enough, enough. The spheres will stop them. They will stay away from the cubes or else. Okay, the, ge the gears were turning. I was trying to turn that into something. It's not happening. I gotta give up on this one. I gotta shelve Shard. this project. Let's trade it at Doma's shop. Maybe next year. Hey, BD1. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Don't 
do that. I fucking love the battle droids so much. They're perfect. All right. Um. Oh, and now we can do that. Cool. Ah, this game is fun. I'm having a good time with the video game. If you can believe it. Let's go. Let's get out of here! Like, wow! There's a bomb chasing me! I'll use the force on it! This likes! Never fuck with me again! What's this? Maximum force increase, don't mind if I do. Say something funny. <laughs> I watched that clip like three times today. The, uh, the, the, like, real voice moment from last stream. What is this? How to get up here? It doesn't seem, like, connected. I wonder. Is that connected? Can I, like, climb up there? Oh, hold on. It kind of looks... kind of looks like I can, get, I can get up there, maybe? The red squares are not breakable barriers, no. Basically, it's... Uh, the, the, the map is separated into three aspects. Red things are things that will eventually unlock, but that you do not have the ability um, to unlock just yet. Um, or, like, you haven't done a puzzle in the nearby area that'll let you unlock it, right? The green stuff, uh, which I don't, we don't currently have right now, uh, but we will soon. Uh, the green stuff is stuff that you can walk through. They're, they're paths that you can activate. They're either like puzzles or breakable barriers or stuff like that. And then the yellow barriers um, are basically just like uh, places that you haven't crossed. They're undiscovered areas, basically. This is like, oh shit. Right here is sort of a, like a threshold into a new zone of the map that you haven't fully defined yet and discovered all the stuff that's there. Um, and that's, that's literally it. That's the three things on the map in terms of like things that denote progress and where you can go and where you've been already. Speaking of... Oh, you can't get up here! Cool! I know I shouldn't do that. But here we are. <laughs> what am I looking at here? Huh. Okay. Doesn't seem like there's much I can do up here. There's a rock I can... Move around. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's fine. Whoa! We just we just fucked up a rancor, so we're kind of okay. No, 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 no. Hey, you know what? Shit. I was gonna say two can play that game. Oh. Two can play that game. <laughs> Bitch. Here. Normal, fine. Let's see what's inside. This thing's got Slice your name all it. over it. Wow. Work, Hunter jacket. Cool. Not going to wear it. 
I like the bomber. Whee! Not a bad sound. Sampling this for sure. But it's missing something. A music maker? There we go. <laughs> oh, cool. Ash Javi and their faithful DJ droid DDEC are some of Kobo's more eccentric newcomers. It is not unheard of for them to be found in often unsafe locations around the, around the valley, sampling whatever sounds catch their curiosity. That's awesome! That's cool! Something interesting? What's this? Garako Sanctuary. Garako constructs uh, nests in the most advantageous areas, protected from the harsh elements and with as wide and visible an approach as possible. Typically, only the female Garako remains in the nest to rest and protect any young while the male spends time hunting for food. Okay. A little bit weird, but... Okay. How to... <laughs> how? <laughs> Let's see. There should be like it's it's seeming like I need to I need to unlock like mounts to use in this area cuz there's like creatures I can ride to get to new places but I have not unlocked them yet so here we go Oh where to next by the way I'm thinking we should maybe continue with the story, but I'm having so much fun running around! Ah! Actually, let's go to Doma's place and, uh, let's meet back up with Turgle, and then we can bring the gyro module to Grease, and then from there, we'll probably have another opportunity to go out and explore. So... Where is that located? Oh yeah, it's Turgle time. This way. Okay, cool. Wait, I just randomly remembered Spider Man 2 is supposed to come out this year, too. What a big year for gaming. It is going to be fucking insane. <laughs> like, Spider Man 2, like, yeah, left in the year, we still have Tears of the Kingdom, Final Fantasy 16. Spider-Man 2, Starfield, uh, Redfall comes out in like a couple days, which I'm really excited about. Um, and even more, even more. Forgot they were making another story of spiders. There's so many games. There are, it's insane. Yeah, Armored Core 6 as well. I'm not like, I, I mean, I'm excited to see what Armored Core 6 is all about. I'm not like, a, I'm not like into Armored Core just yet. But the trailers keep looking really cool, so that's awesome. Um, not to mention Elden Ring expansion, I think is coming out this year. Oh man, it's gonna be insane. Holy fuck. And that and and we still don't even know really what's populating like the back half of the year. There's still gonna probably be like a bunch of stuff in that back half. Oh yeah, the Cyberpunk expansion, dude. Oh my god, it's gonna be crazy. I... I would like to do a Cyberpunk Let's Play when the expansion comes out so I can play kind of like the most updated version of the game. I feel like I've, I've wanted to like start one for a while, but... In the same breath, I'm like, we're so close to the expansion anyway. It's like... I'll just wait. <laughs> Because, like, there's plenty of stuff to play in the meantime. I still need to let's play Dead Space. I don't know. Kind of hope it's not that packed on the latter half of the year. My wallet hurts. I feel that, but also... It probably will be. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> like, especially if we, like, hear anything about, like, new console stuff from Nintendo, which is a likelihood, which is crazy to think about. Hi, Doma. Well, I love Doma! You'll find the finest components in sundries this side of the outer rim. Now that's a Doma Dendra guarantee. Hear that, buddy? 
A guarantee. That's right. Shop's built on trust and quality, and I aim to keep it that way. I wonder what could a shop in this game even like sell? I guess let's find out. Look around. <laughs> This key code will open the locked door in Doma's shop for 10 Priorite shards. Or, oh, what is this? Oh That's my god. My is it? I'm sorry. I can't I can't say <laughs> I'm into it. Go full. It, he literally looks like Cole McGrath in that small preview image. Um, shag, zoinks. Windswept looks very good. The extended mustache, the handlebars. Yo! Okay, Corsair. That looks amazing. No, that's like some... That's like some Leon Kennedy style. Five whole currencies to shave your head. This economy is in shambles. Frontier. Anywhere else. Commander. Wow, is this just a cosmetic shop? A music track can be played at Pylon Saloon provided the jukebox is functioning. I assume that's like a side quest. Holy crap. Oh my god. Okay. So there's some stuff. Um I'm not I'm not gonna get cosmetics with my shards just yet. I'm going to open the door. Ooh, that's a because nice one. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Uh in a way, in its own right, opening doors is what we're here for. Opening doors are simply it's it's simply going to open doors to more opportunities to collect more shards and collect cosmetics. I will I'll get the door. I knew you picked that up. Really? This, this is so unpredictable. Good for nothing raider triggered the security on my storeroom door and now it's locked shut. Maybe your little droid can use this encrypted backup code to get it open? Hell yeah. We're locked out. My goodness, We're not locked out. <laughs> Feel free to take whatever you can make use of. <gasps> the correct choice? Oh! <laughs> what is it? What is it? Stim upgrade? Catch. Wow! Is that it? Is it just a stim upgrade? Oh, wow. Okay. Well, I mean, I was looking for one of those. But also, <laughs> I just spent all of my shards on that. <laughs> That's fine. Who are you? Who's he? <laughs> oh. Hey, Delma, where's Turgle? Is Turgle Hi around? There. I really want to see Turgle. Time for an upgrade. Let's take a look at um that new material I got. Uh, materials. Jedi paint. Whoa! Whoa! Cool! Jedi cream? No way. Jedi white looks really cool also. Man. You can make your lightsaber iPhone 5C style. Make it look like Fisher Price. And I mean that as a compliment. That's so this material cool. Has real style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Jedi cream. I get it. I understand. I'll 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 give you this one. Pretty proud of this one. What new components did we get? It's rugged. Oh, we got the new legs, right? Uh, this is regular BD1 assembly scrapyard. Still loving BD Astro. We're gonna keep that. Um, assembly. Scrapyard. No, yeah, BD1 normal is still good for that. I think I'm gonna I think I'm gonna put his little antenna on. I'm gonna put these on now. I like that. 
I'm gonna give him his ears back. Um, right, we got the, uh, we got the, we got some new legs. We got scrapyard legs. Whoa. That looks pretty, that looks pretty cool. That doesn't look bad. Um, I do think I'm gonna stick with go. the regular though. I, Cause I love, I love when he like, I love when he looks like a little toy, you know? <laughs> like, I genuinely, I just love that he looks like a little, like, like a little eye dog, you know? Which is why I'm keeping him very, like, kind of plasticky and kind of clean, you know? This could work. Yeah, I, I like him looking like you can buy him at GameStop, exactly. You understand. He's so cute. This way. Um... All right, well, no turgle, um, no buy. Oh shit, little divot over there. I love me some divots, you know this about me. You know this about me. Let's explore the divot. Uh, broke, who turgled, woke, where turgle. I think is the sentence I'll say. Oh no. Oh my god, this is so much more expansive than I thought it was gonna be. Let's go. <laughs> well hey there, traveler. <laughs> Hello. Hi there. <laughs> don't mind the beast. She don't like strangers. The mountain. Her name is either. the beast? You be careful. That's awesome. I'll try. I wish my Thanks. name was the beast. Latch on. There we go. Woo! No, 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 no. We just unlocked an entire other section of the map. Oh my god. Oh no. We just unlocked an entire other section of the map. Oh my god. I did not realize. What is happening? What is happening? Holy fuck. Kobo is huge. Have your bells for free. I, hi, Scuba. It's so good to meet you. I love you already. What's your name, lad? If I'm to hold a grudge, best to know the name. I'm Cal. This is BD1. My bantam old mum dubbed me Scuba Stev. <laughs> Scuba the Fisher, am I? You know, there's a fish tank down in Pylon Saloon that could use some attention. Pylon Saloon? That will have infested watering hole down in your valley. All right, all right. Get I ask. Ah, fine, twist my arm. I'll do it. Meet me at the saloon and we'll appraise this so called tank. Tonk. <laughs> okay. Scuba recruited. Okay, very cool. So now, okay, so I'm gonna go back and do this uh, quest, or I'm gonna finish up this uh, this gyro quest. But here's here's a cool thing, and I'm and I'm hoping they introduce this maybe in the story a little bit more. But essentially, if you don't know, they did talk about this in pre-release, so it's not like I'm sharing spoiler information that they did not already discuss. But essentially. Kobo, and this sort of central area of Kobo especially, will actually, like, you can build it over time with, like, new settlers and, like, new kinds of, like, buildings and facilities and stuff. Like, they have an entire fucking, like, town building quest line for this area, I guess. And I'm, I've been waiting so long. Like, ever since I got here, I've been waiting for them to introduce that somehow. Uh, and that was sort of our first little taste of that. And I'm excited because I'm like, oh, I want to see, I want to see real, like, I want to see how deep it goes, basically. Anyway, let's talk to, let's talk to Grease. Hi, Z. Sorry I left you for so long. I was kind of <laughs> doing stuff. I was looking for Turgle. You know how it is. I'm not a Bedlam Raider spy. I'm a friend of Count Kale, what's it? Look, I told you, buddy, you're in the wrong cantina. I don't know anybody named Cal Getz. Hey, Grease. 
Oh, that Calcastus. Found the gyro. <laughs> you made it. Good to see you, Captain. <laughs> Grease Dritus, this is Bodakuna. He was on Coruscant. Wouldn't have made it out alive without his help. Oh, all right. Hi, nice to meet you. Unfortunately, I don't think I have another bed available. Wait a uh, no need, Grease. Another one? You see, well... Now, you have a very bad habit of picking up strays. I am ZNA4, humble servant to the Jedi Order. Oh, I take it you haven't broken the news yet. She was trapped underground. I've never seen this design before. This droid almost looks like an antique. Did you find anything down there worth credits? Credits? <laughs> Cal, you have saved oh, me her animations are giving me life. Oh, here it comes. Master Centauri ordered me to open the forest array, but given my condition, I cannot fulfill that duty. Please. If I fail my mission, the key to Tanalor may be lost forever. She moves like Pearl Steven Universe. Wait a minute. Did you just say Tanalor? You've heard of it? Yeah, it's an old prospector's legend about a lost world filled with treasure. Maybe this story <laughs> proves it's more than a myth. Could be worth checking out. Yeah, but first, I gotta fix the mantis before the raiders snatch it. I'll ask you out there. Watch your back while you make the repairs. Huh. Is he as tough as he looks? Next to Seer, he's the best marksman I've ever met. Okay. We'll take care of the mantis. I'll go see what's in the forest. Thank you, Cal. As soon as I am in full operating order, I will join you in the forest array. <laughs> uh, Z. Stop! She's so cool! <laughs> She's so cool! Sallying forth, why don't you ease up on the thrusters? Come along. I can get you tuned up, shined up, and, uh, caught up on the state of the galaxy. Cal, I'm gonna lock up the saloon so the raiders don't trash it. My Use the back door, would you? Explore Pylon Saloon. Thanks to Cal's efforts, the Rambler Reach outpost is steadily improving. New shops and activities are now available. Doma shop unlocked. Oh, we should have like done this first, basically. <laughs> we we kind of we sequence broke a little bit. That's fine. Um, we're allowed. Doma shop in the Kobo outpost is now available. Rare minerals found across Kobo can be spent here. Recruit for the outpost. Here's what I'm talking about. Across the galaxy, Cal can meet new residents who help improve Rambler's Reach outpost. Make sure to return here to after recruit. Make sure to return here to after recruiting them to Kobo. That's a typo. <laughs> Activates High Republic era technology to access new areas. No kidding. Mm. Some serious firepower. Oh yeah. Relax. Oh shit. You're in safe hands. You'll be all right, Grease. There will in fact be new areas activated. Let me um. How many? This one. Uh, let's see. Oh, this over here. Okay. A couple places. Yeah, my minor grammar mistake. I win that game. I agree. Hey, we never actually talked to you. Let's talk to Zig. You don't look like a raider. What gave it away? No blaster in my face. No spilling drinks and shouting bloody murder. Oh, cute droid too. That's BD1. I'm Cal. About dang time we had some new faces in town. I'm Zig, by the way. Nice to meet you. Oh, thank God. I, th I, I I was so scared she was going to say Zeeg. I was like, fuck, I got it wrong. But nope. I don't know why I, like, was scared of that possibility. Coming right up, Heritage. Coming right up. But something tells me you'd appreciate the soap more after. <gasps> Turg! Strap yourself in. I fear this update might be a little Turg? hard to Turgle. process. Turgle! I just can't. Just called him Turg. Well, where to start? Uh, okay, a few years Hi, ago, Turgle. the Supreme Chancellor decided democracy was out of fashion and declared himself Emperor. The Republic is no more? I'm afraid so. In fact, these days, you'd be hard-pressed to name a planet free from Imperial control. Calamitous indeed. Heritage, you're looking a little low on power. Let's say we pause a tick so you can regain your bearings. Yes, <laughs> perhaps that would be best. 
Hi, Turgle. You brought that droid in? <laughs> Same yeah. her too, huh? Just helped her get back on her feet. And he asked for nothing in return. Well, she did let me hang on to her tuner key. Ooh, a tuner key? What? You found a real one? That's right. Do you think I could maybe... You uh... can't borrow it, Turgle. Ah. Uh. No! Let Turgle have it! Let Turgle have whatever you... Let Turgle have your life if he so requests. I'm really busy, Cal. Maybe later. Turgle doesn't want to talk to me. Okay. Moran, Moran, did you hear what happened? I heard you nearly died. I was crestfallen. It was harrowing. Really made me think about my life, you know? I don't want to die a washed up no clutch on the far edge of the galaxy. Wouldn't that be just dreadful? I couldn't even begin to imagine. Nor will I try. But now, I'm a frog reborn. That yeah! Sure you would buy me a drink to celebrate. You never miss a chance, do you? You have a slimy sense for business opportunities, I'll give you that. But this one's a bust. Go see if someone else will fall for it. I'll fall for it. Turgle, I'll fall for it. Turgle, I'll fall for it. Hi, Moron. Listen, Moron. Friend, what's your name? <laughs> it's Cal. Moran. Charm. You seem a decent sort, Cal. Look. Maybe you're just the latest fool to get tangled up with the Bedlam Raiders, or maybe you're the real deal. But this place will bleed you dry. Understand? Get out while you can. Noted. Wow, he really is a moron. <laughs> Let's talk to this cool cat. Cage. Weird bucket of bolts you dragged in. Well, actually, she's a droid from the High Republic. Don't care. Run along now. I can see why you sit alone. Oh! Oh, she's mean! I love her! Hi, can- you're mean. Can I talk to you more? Damn it. Oh, hi, Zig. Kobo's a big planet. There's gotta be someone out there who thinks like me. <laughs> no response. I, I don't know what to do. I'm having so much fun. Hello, gonk droid. Little trash can man. Alright. Let's see. We could open the forest gate. Or we could do something else. <laughs> The world is our oyster. I just don't know. I just don't know. Here, let's, um... God. I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. There's, like, too much stuff to do. I'm, like, overwhelmed. Here. Excuse me? Wait, 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 wait. I see, I hear, I listen. I taste. What is you taste? happening here? <laughs> well, no, Moran. Don't engage. I Heard see, I hear, I listen, I taste. A while back. Were you a big shot business guy? Oh, oh, did you blow it? Why else would you end up here? Uh, that's... I suppose if you sniff around long enough, you're bound to eventually find dirt. I was right? What's keeping this secret worth to you? <laughs> I don't think so, my desperate friend. But, to your credit, you have exceeded my expectations. Granted, they were breathtakingly low expectations, but nevertheless, let that be your reward. Where's that guy we were supposed to talk to about the fish tank? This stage has seen better days. No kidding. Wasn't he supposed to... Weren't we supposed to meet him back here? That guy? Fish guy? Uh... 
let's see. This is the way out. Rumor. Oh, check out the saloon's aquarium. What? How do I... I get up there. I guess it's it's one of these. I guess it's one of these locked doors. Oh. Ooh, hold on. Can I squeeze through? That can't be up to code. Even out here on the frontier. Even out here on the frontier. Here. Okay, I can't get over here. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if we can get to it yet. Weird. Okay, not there. This way? Oh! Oh! Hold on. Oh, that'll probably just bring me back to... Yeah, that's just back to ground level. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Do I have to... What if I track the rumor? That doesn't do anything. <laughs> okay. Uh... Oh, no! Yeah, I was wondering. I was like, can I get on top? But then I was like, how would the other guy know to get on top? But then also, why would we be able to tell him to come back here and talk to us if we weren't able to do that right away? Huh. Okay, well, um, I think I will do some exploring. There, we got a lot of stuff to cover on Kobo, it seems. Oh, hello. not wrong. Whoa. Finger lip garfon. Ah, did you see that beauty? Two plump fins. A fine compliment to glands. A scrumptious varicose tongue. Hmm. Fishing on an empty stomach, Scuva? Hey, I can't succumb to the passions of the stomach. The garfon must live. I'd better get me mind off it. Um, not just yet. Thank you for the offer, though. Oh my god. Stop! Stop growing! <laughs> Me at the molds. Ah! No, scan, scan it, please. Oh, I missed the prompt. Whoa, scan. If if I don't scan every new enemy I kill, it is gonna be a nightmare to platinum this if I so choose. I assume. I don't actually know if there's a trophy for it, but I assume there is. 
me do this! Thank you. <laughs> what happened? Oh. Yay! Alright, that's open. For business. I want to go into this little room. Frustrated, but I'm like I'm like delighted, but also in a way that frustrates me. Why is this game so big? What did they do? How did they do that? It's genuinely overwhelming. Oh my god, and this is gonna take me to like another What? Is this like another dungeon? I'm gonna lose my mind. Alignment Control Center. What is going on? Since when is this Resident Evil? Wonder what this is, buddy. What is happening? Okay, well, let's save. What is the alignment control center? Oh my god. Now I see why they... Now I see why they went for fast travel in this one. It's starting to make more sense, especially on Kobo. God, yeah, this is like really... This is really... It's like, this is delightful, but in its own right, it's also making me just like so viciously sad because moment to moment playing like a functioning version of this game i am experiencing so much like wonder and joy and i'm just having so much fun discovering everything and then occasionally i'm like oh yeah this game is broken for a lot of people and they are like actively not able to have this experience because like the release date fucked them over and they weren't able to optimize. And so it just like, it's all here and it's all so good, but if it doesn't work, you're never gonna get that, right? And that's, and that's the bummer part about it is that underneath all of that garbage, this is a phenomenal game so far and I am genuinely loving it. But then it's like, what happened? Anyway, just just a little aside. We don't have to dwell on it because I am really enjoying this. But also, it's just it's just it's unfortunate because clearly, like, there was some sauce behind this game. Like, there was some. This team was going at it. <laughs> Wonder what this was for. Bad for an abandoned facility. What am I looking at here? Whoa. What? Oh, that makes sense. I was <laughs> like, I can't do anything. God damn, we gotta come back. Holy shit. Sauce needed to just marinate a bit longer for PC. Well, in all fairness, it needed to marinate a bit longer everywhere. It's stable enough on, on console in the quality mode, but it is still extremely poorly optimized and there's still a lot of problems even on console. The whole thing is kind of fucked by its performance. There's only the force. Okay. 
Let's go somewhere else then. Oh my god, I, I don't know where. I don't know what to do. Here, uh... Actually, you know what? We're not too far Off from more... Go. So I've just heard more stuff about the PC version. No, you're not wrong. Like, like I, I wanted to extend the... The scope of that statement because I, I don't think it does well to undercut just how poorly optimized the whole thing is like it's not just a bad pc port it is like something really went wrong during like the optimization phase of this game um something kind of fucked it over in a way that affects all platforms however you are correct that the pc version is by far the worst like the pc version is absolutely like truly broken in a way that the console versions, thankfully, do not have to deal with as much. But yeah, on PC, it is it is straight up, like, busted. It's really sad. I wonder... <laughs> Can I, like... <laughs> Hold on. That's not... I was wondering if that was a wall run point. I think I can just... Yeah, there we go. And I think I can maybe wall run back up. Oh! Harmony Pummel. Alright. Okay. Let's get out of here and find something else to do. Oh my god. I'm, I'm seriously like overwhelmed right now. I'm like I like I know I'm technically making progress and doing stuff, but also at the same time, because we're not doing the story, I'm like I'm making no progress. I'm spending so much time on side content, but it's like no, this is the game. Did Fallen Order run good? I barely played it. Um, on release, it actually did have similar issues, just not to the same scale. Like, it, it had a lot of problems, but it wasn't, like, broken, essentially. Um, but it did have issues, yeah. Similar issues, even. The, the charge is set. Get back! What, nothing? Uh, I thought you said this was good thermite. Breaking, not entering. Let's grab this, BD1. Can we? This terminal will have to Damn wait. it. No. Does it mark that? It does not. I am so ready to end some enemies. Wait, there are enemies around here? There had better be. <laughs> You're going down. Hi, I'm enemies. Oh, Battle droids be like, I want to end some enemies. I'm, I'm, I drop in like, I'm enemies. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I didn't scan them. Whoops. It's still going. It's still going. There's still more. I thought. I thought. I didn't. I didn't understand. I didn't understand just how. Oh my god! I didn't understand how much was here. We have done two. No, we've done three streams of this. Two like full streams, and we have not gotten past the second planet. This is why I'm like. Oh god, <laughs> like how how much time is this gonna take? And then like playing this alongside Tears of the Kingdom, that's gonna be an ordeal. Oh! This guy is a cool design. Seems like a problem for me. I circle back around, hold on. No, not you! Get out of my way. I'm not dealing with you right now.
Whoa, okay. Weird. I wonder if I could if I could have force pushed him or something. No. Damn it. It's fine. Oh, no, no. Nope. here. Very cool animations, as usual. Scan it. Nice job, BD. Bioma. I like that. I like that. I guess in here, somehow, how we get up there. I had to assume. Nope, it's just a scan. Prospectors didn't stand a chance. The prospector. Oh! Sorry. <laughs> Prospectors didn't stand. They sit. More enemies? In here? Shouldn't have. I mean that. Oh, the music is so nice right now. This is all a big misunderstanding. Turgle! You gotta let me go. Oh, yeah. Why should we? Uh, I could be of use to you. Yeah, 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 that's it. Whatever you want. I'm your frog. Oh, oh we'll see. Boss is looking for something. Find it, or we'll find you. Shit. Turgle makes a deal. Turgle, having crossed the ruthless Bedlam Raiders, attempts to take shelter in a nearby cave, failing to shake his pursuers, however, begs for his life, making a dark bargain he will later come to regret. I guess that is then where we met him after the fact. Come on. Don't make me circle all the way back around. Ah! Okay, fine. I wonder if I could just, uh... Come on, no! Oh, shit, hold on. A solution? Can maybe... There is no fucking way you're not going to let me grab onto that ledge. There's no way. You're not going to arbitrarily keep that ledge from me, are you? Okay, thank God. Th that seemed very unlike them. Who are you? Did you get off of the chest? Gara? That's quite an arsenal you've got there. Arsenal? What? Why do you ask this of Gara? Business is none of yours. I'm not here to make trouble. What do you plan to do with all this? I present this gift to Ravis. Great tribute, yes? Tribute? You mean you want to join the Raiders? Join the Raiders, yes. No more prospecting, no longer others saying weak of Gara. Much <laughs> glory and blood of Ravis. The Raiders are dangerous and not known to strike deals. Danger? <laughs> Gara, gorge self on danger. Gara, live for thrill of kill. But you <laughs> are not killer like Gara. You are deaf to the call of battle. You do not want to join the raiders. Gara doesn't want to join the raiders. No, wait. Unreliable. The raiders are unreliable. It's too we shouldn't have done to this. bargain with them. Yes. Raiders? Not to be trusted. Too dangerous for Gara. No, no. Deal is off. Too risky. Contraband. Here. You take. Gara no wants. No! All right, then. We accidentally were a cop. Shit. What have I done? Again, I gotta say, the side characters, they're doing a lot for me. 
they're kind of making this game for me. You're just gonna leave all this here? Not to say they're the only good part, but. Gara gets rid of rest. Too risky for kids. Mountaineer. <laughs> you weren't a cop, you saved her life. We can split hairs all we want. <laughs> but I, I shouldn't have brainwashed her. I don't like this. I'm telling you, this bomber look. It's it's gonna be tough to pass this. Saving lives is literally the I was kidding! <laughs> I was joking! It was a thing I said in two seconds, I wasn't thinking! Guys, come on, you gotta believe me. I guess we should go to this big area. <laughs> so called tolerant left. Love this. Love this energy. I don't love this energy. What is this? Oh, cool. Another big thing to do. <laughs> what the fuck? What's all, what's all this then? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, where to? Beef stew? Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh, no! No, 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 no! Soinks! What the fuck? Hey, come this way. <laughs> that's so cool! I'm sorry, that's so cool. That's actually awesome. They dropped so many on me. And for what? Okay, they're gone now. No, they're not! <laughs> Fuck! Oh my god, they're resilient! No, no, no! Jesus Christ, okay. There are more? Is that one from back there still trying to get me? Yeah, literally! Not, they haven't de aggroed yet. Here, come on. It'll be fun. I know you want to. I'm stuck! Oh, I know. Help me. Oh, uh, give me a sec. Huh? Did you do that? Wait, what? No! Dude, so many dead prospectors in this part of the game. On the ceiling, please! Okay. That didn't work out. <laughs> oh, no! Ah! Oh, I understand. We need to, like, open this door, I guess. I can't get them onto the ceiling. Darn. Well, that's that, I guess. We'll, we'll find out what that's all about later. Oh my God, I don't know what to do. I feel like I have been here for like half a day. I've been streaming for less than three hours. The, the expansiveness of this is like really fucking with my Percep perception of time.
I think. I don't know how much of this I'm going to be able to do on stream. Okay. I have to... I have to investigate something here. Just for my own sanity. What are the how long to beat stats like? Ah, okay. See, that makes sense. So, like, main story... Couple entries sitting around like 20, 20 hours or so. Main and extras sitting around like 32 to like 35, maybe close to 40 if you're going really leisurely with it. Um, completionist run jumps all the way up to 51, according to one playthrough logged here. So, yeah, that's that seems about right based on what I'm seeing here. Um, although not as big as I feared. I think this is gonna be, like, super doable. You know, this is, like, it's it's just seeming like this is up there in the scale of, like, God of War Ragnarok. Which we were able to cover, like, decently well. Although near the end, I did have to start kind of fast-tracking the story. But, um, yeah, it's it's it seems like it's of a similar scope, which I can handle. That That feels right. Good to know. Don't I was just hoping it, like... Hell yeah, I just oh. saved your fool life. Who are you, anyway? <laughs> I'm Turgle. Well, if you want to keep breathing, you best follow me. This is Raider territory. More Turgle. Getting a lot of Turgle backstory. Um. Also, yeah, so... What I was, uh... What I was worried about was, like... <laughs> if if that completionist time was up there in like the 80s and then the main and extras was up there in the 50s because that's that's what Kobo was starting to seem like uh oh don't bark don't bark wait should I gotta meditate let's stop boiling bluff The question is if you'll be able to come back here much later. Oh, we certainly will. This is like this is like our hub zone. Right? Like this this is where we're gonna like reconvene and we there's like a whole like base building system that's gonna like span most, if not the entire game, I assume. Like Kobo is gonna be a place we return to. At least that's the impression I get. So obviously I don't have to do everything right now. I can elect to do some of the story in just a second and kind of progress things further, which is what I think I will do just so that we can maybe get some extra sites going, um, get some like visual, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Variation? I don't know if that's it, but. What my frazzled associate is trying to I feel like I recognize this voice. Who is this? Oh, wait, is it Yuri Lowenthal? Wait. Panic attack. <laughs> Actually, can't tell where that's. No, I seriously, like, I can't.
Hold on. Oh, shit. Here we go. This has to be it. Nope. Never mind. Can I just not do this yet? It's like nothing else I can interact with. Yeah, I know there's an echo up there, but I'm like, how do I... Oh, shit. Hold on. Maybe... All right, what's this? Oh, quit complaining. I'm almost done. Mosey! <sighs> there. Good as new. Whew, oh, you know thing. what? Hold on. I see why they call you gliders. I understand what's going on. Fly around all the Kobo, couldn't you? <laughs> okay, off you go. Don't be a stranger. No, no, I understand what's going on. We're not able to do this yet, essentially. Because we have to unlock the ability to use this mount to get up there. So, let's go back. And I think I am actually going to open the forest gate, as it were. Um. So let's do that to the best of our ability. Yes, the beast. The, yeah, the chocobo. It is very chocobo-like. You're not wrong. God, now that's just got me excited for FF16 again. All right, we got to get to this thing right here. That did it. There's a couple divots. We gotta we gotta get to the second divot. <gasps> whoa! 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 Look at this one! Look at this one! <gasps> You're beautiful! Oh my god, I really hope you spawn again later once I'm able to ride y'all. Holy shit. The hot pink bitch was named Breakfast! I can't believe they stuck me on patrol with a lousy droid. Hey, how do you think I feel? <laughs> That's the enemy, blockhead! Come on. You're fun. My god won't break. Scan it. Scan them. Scan them. BD1, scan them! <laughs> BD1! Oh shit, wait, I can scan them before I fight them. Right. I forgot. Okay, I'll, I have to do that next time. Wait, actually, we've already scanned that model of droid. There's there's a battle droid I'm pretty sure that we have not scanned yet. And I'm trying to remember which one it is, but I can't recall immediately. Either way, let's go up here. BD, BD is the Metroid Prime scan visor. No, literally, I've, I've been thinking about like every... Every time I scan something after fighting it, I'm like, wow. People who watched me play Metroid Prime and got so pissed off that I wasn't really scanning a whole lot are gonna hate this. <laughs> but with Metroid Prime, it's not just a, a press of the of down on the D-pad, okay? It's so much easier to just like passively scan stuff. What'd you find? Look at that. And that's that. What's that, bud? Boom. I hate to say it, but they kind of got one over on, on Metroid. This place is gorgeous. I don't know if they did, they had 20 years. Good point. I need to get to Prime 2. That's definitely another one I've I've been. Damn. 
I hope he's okay. It's another one I've been really meaning to play as soon as I get the chance. Next time I have a spot for like a like a Tuesday stream slot that isn't a new release is probably when I will do Metroid Prime 2. Oh, that didn't do shit. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, bad start. Bad start. That's fine. Whoa, whoa. Hey, buddy. No, 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 no. <gasps> Goodbye, your hand. Oh, my God. Actually kind of beneficial to get grabbed there. He is insane. I'm hit. He doesn't fuck around. Wow, I made him really mad with the hand thing. I can't imagine why. Damn. What's this thing? A mogu. Wow. Hold on, sorry, I'm checking my phone. Okay. Oh, shut up! Come on! <laughs> I, I, no! 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 It's a mogu! God damn it! You're all dead to me. You know what? If you, if you, if you handed me a sub, I would spit on it. That was not the way to the tree door. No, not like a sandwich. Like a, I'm on Twitch, like a subscriber. Diamond Dynamo, thank you so much, and also Patui. Yeah, that's right. Found another shard. Oh, the music is so nice right now. <gasps> Wait. Well, not anymore. Damn, goodbye. Goodbye, the vibes. Dead Eye Survivor jukebox mode, where are you at? I mean, they literally have a jukebox in, in the cantina that we have to restore eventually. Well, we don't have to, but we can. We literally saw earlier you can buy music for it uh, with little crystals. Oh. What's this? Turgle's shiny shell. Outpost residents will rarely attest to Turgle's elation at having found a particularly remarkable shell and his subsequent despair at having lost it. This appears to be that shell, though it is by no means provable nor worthy of further investigation. Guys, you know... You know when they said it takes a village to, to raise a Turgle? This is what they were talking about. Oh, that's the tree gate. This game fucking rules. Genuinely just loving this. Hashtag Saturday feeling loving Jedi survivor. Hashtag love. Hashtag elation. Hashtag turgle. 
Hashtag Saturday feeling. Hashtag turbo dogs. True. Can we not? No! But how? No, we scanned. We scanned both of them. The key to Tantalor is in the forest ray. The tuner Z gave Cal will open the way. Yeah, if we can get there. Oh, hold on. There's gotta be a way up here. Circles around enough that I will take it as a detour. Whoa, shit! No scan? Nope. Okay. Whoa! Nice try. Stop. They are they're extremely fun to fight. Tactical pants. Those uh those droids might honestly be my favorite enemy in the game so far. New pants. Not getting as many color options on on the new options. Or on the new cosmetics. Bit of a bummer. It's okay though. <clears throat> Maybe you unlock them separately? Uh No, well, I don't know. I don't think so, because I feel like some of the some of the other ones we've newly unlocked came with color options, but I could be wrong. I don't know. We'll see. It's not super disappointing either way. Just a little bit of like a, oh. Not every, I because the beginning of the game gave me the impression that every option was going to have like a set of colors. But um, I have been proven incorrect. I need to I need to pay attention to that a little more. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on. BD, I need help. Shit. Hurry. I don't know what the blue glow attack actively means, but usually things that glow blue are things that I can interact yeah, with so using beating. a force push or a pull. So my assumption is that I need to either push or pull that, but I keep forgetting. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, this, this, is my, this is my way across. I am on the other side. Very cool. And then hopefully... Whoa! Uh-oh. 
Oh, that's fine. Can we create the bridge this way now? No? I guess we still gotta wait for that other thing. Okay. Um. Damn. I, I wish I could have all three stances on me. I, 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 that's gotta be like an upgrade, right? I feel like it would be totally feasible to be able to have three stances across just the left and right D-pad. You would just have a third one to select. It's it's like it's it's totally not a necessary limitation. I'm wondering if that's an upgrade or I don't know. We'll see, but I I hope so. Cause I hate I hate having to pick stances at a meditation point. I think I have to, right? Yeah, because I can't switch here. Can't really switch in like the customize menu or anything, so I have to be at a meditation point to switch stances. But like, it's not like I'm getting like a shit ton of other stances. I have three. Maybe they'll add another one later, and that's why it's limited in the way it is. But right now, just having three, uh, and not really seeing any immediate evidence for an increase in that, it's weird. We'll see. Interesting. Ooh! Tactical shirt. Don't mind if I do. That actually looks looks good. Not too different than what we already had, but cool. The Imperial Patrol should be out closely at any minute now. The sooner the better. Oh, that's our shortcut. We'll kill him and take it. Okay. I have a theory about how many there will be in total. It's based on info you already have, but I won't say if it's too close to spoilers. Well, I... So, like, looking at the... Stances... Menu... I don't know. It... Oh, yeah. Yeah, the lightsaber tree. That is interesting. Yeah, I'll, I'll have to take a look at that. There, there could be more stances. There could be more stances. I, I would I would totally... I, I believe if there's evidence that there could be more stances, then I will absolutely accept the limitation. I was just thinking, like, if it's limited to three, then this is a weird choice. But otherwise, I can see it. Whoa, should have jumped. I, won't die yet. I thought you were dead. I thought I Stay I thought I took care of all of his health, but I think I was just Battle. looking at his uh, block meter. I'll never stop fighting. Whoa, Nilfnar, thank you so much for the $50 tip. It's been a tough few years, but we always have Snap Q2 on the TV. It just makes the house a brighter and happier place. Aw. Thank you. What the fuck? That, that means so much to me. Thank you. And thank you again for an extremely generous donation. Wow. It was very, very kind of you. Um... Yeah, wonderful. Okay, let me uh examine this. These raiders are keeping the empire at bay. At least they're good for something. Ayo. True. Here we go. Open the forest gate. Oh shit! Here we go.
The array should be out here somewhere. Only way forward is to cut through. Whoa! Basalt rift. You catch that too, BD? We're not alone out here. Looks like it's blocked. Sit oh. tight, BD. Let me Wait, see what I what? can do. It's no use, BD. Oh, oh, by that. Okay. Let's go. Oh. I'll cut this. That do it? No, not quite. The way you run into everything makes me anxious. I just like have ADHD. Shard. It's nothing to be so concerned about. Good to go, BD. Let's try that again. Yep, that should do it. Oh! He came back around. Now let's scan this guy. What a what a wonderful um consideration that I would want to scan that well after I've killed it. Given BD was away. <laughs> yeah, I don't think that's how rocks work. Yeah, you know, we can uh Hey, listen. It's it's a space fantasy. We can pretend. This whole thing is pretend. Um sorry to break it to you, but Some of these rock columns are loose. Some of these rock columns are loose, he says. <laughs> okay. I see. The first. Can I see why kids love this the cinnamon taste of cinnamon toast crunch? Jury's still out. What do you think this array is, buddy? Centauri Kree said it held the key to Tantalor. Z seems to think so too. Only one way to find out. Stop now, I want Cinnamon Toast Crunch. Cinnamon Toast Crunch is not only delicious, it's also... I don't think they saw us. Let's move. Objectively the best cereal to eat without milk. I don't often eat it without milk if I have a choice. But it is not the worst that way. In fact, it's still quite good. This is a fantastic looking scene. Wait, what is? Oh, oh, secrets. This... Whoa, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Dude, I miss my couch setup. This fucking office chair I'm working with, it's not the vibe for like long play sessions. It's really, really not. I wonder how long this has been here. I took it for granted. I stopped using my couch setup, uh, like, 
kind of near the end of living in my last apartment. And now and, and now I'm like, I I should I shouldn't have done that. I should have used it more while I had it. Cause now I miss it. And I've and I have no space. Um to do it in my, in my current office. At least not in a way that I would be happy with. Did you use a house for your PC? No, I had I had a, a fantastic setup. I had such a good setup where What is this? That's yeah, I was like that's maybe not going to work. Um I had a desk and I had it like slots for my um, microphone arm on the side of the desk and I also had a, a couch with a TV and uh, slots for my monitor arm on either side of the couch, and I also had two microphones. And so basically, all of these pieces together made it so that I could either sit at my desk and stream from my desk with a single microphone, or I could move the microphone over and stream from my couch with a single microphone, or I could take the other microphone and add it to the second uh, stand holder on the other side of the couch and uh, have like a double microphone set up. Um, and it was very, very cool. It was super modular, but it's just not, it's not the vibe for where I currently live. I would have had to have like taken that into account from the very beginning of putting this office together. And since I wasn't using it nearly as much towards the end of uh, my last, like living in my last apartment, I didn't take into account how much I would miss it. Uh, and, I, and honestly, a big thing is really just like, it's just, I can't get super comfortable in this chair. And also playing with controller, I have this weird thing right now where playing with controller, I like, I'm resting my hands on my desk while I play and it gets extremely uncomfortable for some reason, but then there's no other place I can comfortably put my hands while I'm sitting comfortably at my desk. So it's either my hands are comfortable or my body is comfortable. And so I would much rather my body be comfortable while I'm playing so that I'm not like fucking squirming all over this place. Um, <laughs> squirming all over this place is what I've said. Um, or if I like, if I like, kind of like sit up a little bit more and maybe like sit forward and put my hands like on my lap instead, that's much more comfortable for my hands, but then it's less comfortable for my actual like seating position. And then also on top of that, my arm, my chair arms suck. They don't, they don't suck, but they, they, they're like adjustable, but not in the way that I need them to be adjustable. If I, could just take them and like pull them in a little bit like horizontally it would be perfect like i would have no problems but instead here's here's what happens they are the same horizontal distance away from like the sides of my body and from the chair itself but i can adjust them height wise and i can adjust them by like rotating them on like a pivot, either facing outwards or facing inwards. But the problem is that either which way, it is not covering the full like extent of like my forearms. So like if I have them like pointing outwards from the front, then like my, my elbows are a lot more comfortable and they're able to reach it like easier Raiders right so like they can they can like relax a little bit easier but then my forearms are like stuck in the air and they can't they can't reach it unless i'm holding them outwards which i can't do when i'm playing a controller game and i also can't do it when i'm playing anything honestly like only when i'm like actually just reclining and watching something could i do that but then 
if I point them inwards, I can I can rest my forearms, but then my elbows don't have anywhere to rest. <laughs> but then when they're facing straight forward, I can rest my entire forearm on them and it's comfortable, but they're too far from my body. And so if I and and so when I'm holding a controller, I can't rest my arms on the chair arms because they're too far from my body. It's a nightmare. <laughs> I don't like this chair anymore. Anyway. The only way that I can like still like rest my elbows and my forearms and my hands on something all at once is if I rest my hands on my desk, but then, then my hands start to get cramped because I, I I have all this like pressure on the bottom of my hands, or like technically on the on like the outer side of my hands, right? Like the pinky side, because they're just resting on the table under the weight of like the controller, and I'm not really using them very much, and so it just gets like really stiff down there, and I'm like, what? Ah! Okay, sorry. I know way more focused rant than that needed to be, but I needed to like pay attention to the position of my chair so I could explain my situation correctly. Oh shit, stormtroopers. Hello. <laughs> Hold on. Zoom, enhance. Okay, so I dodged. I started charging up a special attack the same exact time as him. Who hit first? What just happened? <laughs> that was so cool. Wait, that actually was awesome. We literally did a nothing personnel kid. No, straight up. <laughs> we teleported behind him and slashed him. That was so cool. That's the best thing I've ever done. You managed to accidentally bypass that enemy's whole gimmick? Uh, yeah, because I'm badass. They must have shot this drop pot all the way from the Lucre Hulk. <laughs> Can I scan him still? Yeah, that's good. Awesome. Shield trooper. This guy is not scannable. Okay. Cool. Wow. Holy shit. That was so funny. Okay. Let's get a drop on these bucket heads. Bucket heads. Um, I would like to kill the other one. Scan, 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 scan. Nope. Okay. Generations of Raka raised their young here. Then the Empire tore through, shot and trampled anything that got in their way. Same story, different planet. Love that. Okay. Do have them both. Perfect. Let's go.
Didn't stand a chance. Oh. Activate every pipe bomb now. Shortcut unlocked. Oh. Nice. Okay, cool. So, deeper down, I guess, is where we're going. Holy fuck, this planet is big. This is insane. This is crazy. It's still going. It just keeps going. Okay. Down we go. Woohoo! Whoa! Oh. oh god. Oh, please. Hello. Okay. Problem. God damn it. I keep missing it. I want to try it. I'm just, I'm too busy pressing all my normal buttons. It did it. I did it again. What if I kind of stay my distance? Come on. Try it. I wanna do it. Come on. Do the blue. Do the blue thing, please. I'm begging you. Please. Do something different. There we go. No, I was healing! I was healing! God damn it! The moment I chose to heal. I'm so mad. Do it again. 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 Please. Come on, man. Do it, do it, do it. Come on. Oh. Okay, scream. There we go. <laughs> I got it. Fucking finally. That's the stupidest thing I've done in this game so far. But it worked. Hello, BD1. Me on a scan. Biomaw's Revenge. <laughs> uh, that sounds like a problem. Oh, can't miss this chest. Woohoo! Need to open this. Oh, yeah, I need a hunter pants. I am never going to wear those, just so you know. Sorry to say. Not the vibe. I wonder... Yep, okay. Thought so. Sorry, no hunter pants. I have good taste. You cannot tell me that that is not climbable. You can't do it. Oh shit, it's timed. Uh, go, 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 go. Woo! No! No, 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 no! <laughs> Damn it. It's fine. It's fine. It's not like I, it's not like I cared or anything or I wanted to do that the first time. I was just showing them, uh, how not to do it. Yeah. See, it's like a professional strategy guide gamer. I was just showing my fans the best way to go about it. Even before she was damaged, there's no way Z could have made this journey. And of course, back in Kree's day, there was no empire to contend with. But I would give to see a glimpse of that galaxy. Whew. Hold on. Get a stretch. Hello. Hey, 
easy, easy. I'm not looking for trouble. I'm just petting a creature. It's all right. What is it? Hello. Don't worry. Toa. I'm a friend. Oh, mother of Moons, that's a relief. I'm useless in a fight. Love Can your you mascara. Incredible High Republic structure. Didn't expect to have to fight off beasts with my field journal. Sorry, rambling. Bad habit. D I'm Toa, by the way. I'm Cal. This is BD1. Listen, the Empire is not going to be happy to find you out here. Why don't you head back to the Reach? I think I will take you up on that. Nice. Explore the High Republic Chamber in the forest. Anything else? You get a good look at that structure? Only enough to see there's no way I'm getting inside. But we're lucky. It looks intact. If I'm right, it's been out here for centuries. Maybe you'd have better luck than I did. It's right up ahead. Thanks for the tip. Oh, fuck. Sorry. I did not stretch nearly as much as I needed to. You know what? Fuck it. Stretch break. Woo! Okay. Oh, yeah. It's stretch zone. Um, I might want to take a break soon. But first, let's find a better stopping point. By cutting down rocks. Shortcut unlocked. Hey, look at that. A stopping point. <laughs> Just go back to this meditation point. Okay. All right. Let me rest up here. And then I am going to step away for a moment. Uh, and I'll be back. And a few with some more lightsaber. Mm -mm -mm. I love me a 20 minute break. Hell yeah. Hits like nothing else. How's it going, everybody? I'm back. You know what? I just ate an entire bowl of cereal. <laughs> so I'm feeling pretty good. Yeah, it was 20 minutes. I, I left the stream at 724. And it's currently 746. So a little over 20 minutes, actually. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was 20 minutes, at least. It was not Cinnamon Toast Crunch, no, it was actually, uh, it was Honey Nut Cheerios. I had a choice between Honey Nut Cheerios and, uh, Honey Bunches of Oats. And normally, in that scenario, I would go for the Honey Bunches of Oats. But I, I have actually, I had actually, I had not had Honey Nut Cheerios in, like, a long time. And it was a, it was a fresh box, never opened, so... Went for it. Um, and you know what? Honestly, kind of wish I had gone for the honey bunches of oats, but that's fine. We all make mistakes. We all uh, we all push past our limits. I'm feel I'm feeling the the honey nut Cheerios. I can feel how they are settling in my stomach, or more accurately, not choice. doing so. Someone else has eyes out here. Maybe the raiders. But anyway, why does it? Why? Why is BD One always like so eager to look like at the ceiling? Question: I'll drink the milk after. Oh, absolutely. Wouldn't dream of not doing that. Sorry. <laughs> oh no! To the no sneezing! Got it. 
Wow, that was the most unsatisfying sneeze I've had in a while because it was mid combat. Jesus. What does the Empire want with a backwater planet? That like came from the back of my throat. Crew cut. Oh no. Oh no. It's not that bad. I don't like it though. You know, I've I've really look. this Let's bun has look. really grown on me. It's gonna take some doing to to surpass this this bun beard look. Oh my god, so much. <laughs> Rumor: Explore the High Republic chamber in the forest. Right. Okay, that's what uh, Toa was talking about. Well, then what's the the forest array is so far. Are these the same objective? Technically, like like if we go to the I don't know, it's kind of it's hard to say. Whatever. Um Like I know they're not the same objective, but it's like would one kind of naturally lead into the other? I guess we will find out. Uh oh. Let's try not to end up like that guy. <laughs> oh no. Uh oh. Oh no. <laughs> no, we're about to end up like that guy. That's okay. We've beaten one of these before. We can do it. No, <laughs> never mind. Just kidding. There goes your hand, idiot. Jesus Christ. This guy is crazy. I need help. Oh, there goes. You can't take off both of his hands? That seems like an arbitrary limitation. Could you use some help, buddy? I guess not as a reward, basically, for getting caught by him twice. <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, okay. Okay. Looks like a data disk. No kidding. That'd be unfair, Penny. How would he fight? You see, the goal is that he wouldn't. <laughs> Think of it this way and get back to me. Here, hold on. Please consider. Do what you will. Is that Rift Passage? Hello? Scuba? Step in the lot. This one's a rare catch indeed. What is it? He's gonna you gonna give me another fish? Starfish. It's tail is one ribbon with greed, soaked to the bone with tragedy. The what tragedy? on account of their succulent glands. But I do not intend to harvest the poor creature for its organs. <clears throat> okay. Big mouth paw. I intend to bring it back to the saloon, where I might one day find a meat for it. Playing matchmaker, Aww. huh? You found another faw fish before? about leaving the world better than you find it. A ripple's only as good I thought it was about catching fish. Every tail, lad. Uh, sorry, no. I don't have the energy to listen to the stories. I appreciate it. 
he keeps offering to tell me stories and it's always like when I'm in the middle of something, you know? I'm like, if you can wait until we're back at the saloon and I have a moment to just like sit down and listen to dialogue, I'd love to hear some stories, but like, I'm doing a level. <laughs> like I'm doing a level right now. Oh yeah, he is kind of blathers coded. Yeah, that's a good point. What the hell? Ah, <laughs> it keeps going. Wait, okay. No. I will not. I refuse. This is the rumor. Let's do the rumor. The array is close. Just a forest full of beasts and Imperials to get through first. Oh, stim, stim, stim. Heads up, BD. Very cool. VeggieTales taught me about rumors and weed in the same in the same breath, weirdly. Dude, get this. Larry Boy for a new generation. Zoomer weed. That must be another one of those high republic chambers. What do you say, buddy? Up for a little detour? <laughs> Does anyone... <laughs> I just, just read the chat message. Does anyone have any idea what she just <laughs> No, not even I do. I'm sorry. <laughs> I wish I could give you more than this. Wait, what's the hot villain you're into? Oh, you know, the bad apple. From, uh, from Larry Boy and the Bad Apple. Episode, episode title, Larry Boy and the Bad Apple. Yeah, she's a baddie. Baddie apple. I showed that tweet to my friend and she totally agreed. Like, seriously, based people agree with my tweet. Welcome it's a fact of life. Centauri Cree. Oh, shit. The path that we must walk is not always immediately visible to us. Only through patience, careful thought, and the wisdom of the Force will the way appear. Dude, are these High Republic temples gonna be like the equivalent of, like, shrines. Yeah, puzzle zone. That's so cool! This effect is so cool. This is like one of my favorite visual effects in the game. These uh these walkways. Legitimately so cool. So, they believe something is behind the abyss? That's right. A planet. Well, I hope it's worth all this effort. A <coughs> Fuck. Sorry. Disney Assassin's got me, because I was about to say, a treasure planet. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> I, just, I choked. I got poisoned. I don't know. 
I can't explain. Go lucky Jedi. No, my ball. Come back, balloon. Come back. Yay. Yeah, I got like what like what would Cal do if this orb just did not j regenerate like that? He just he just fucking he just dropped it like beefed it that bad. Like just leave at that point. What else? What else do you do? You're done. We're done. was not expecting that. That was quite literally the last thing I expected this room to do. Why is there so much more stuff here than I thought? This is like the tagline of this game right now. It's just like, why is there more? What the fuck? I'm not even supposed to be here. Okay. Something very funny about you freaking out about an elevator. Was it not like the whole room like moving down? Cause I swear that's what it looked like to me. Was that just an elevator? Cause I swear to God from where I was looking. Oh my God, no, it, I, okay. That's why I was freaking out. Cause I swear to you. I don't know if I'm just crazy right now, but the, it looks like the entire room like moved basically. Oh, I died. <laughs> well, now I feel a little silly. No, like, 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 okay, listen, listen. I don't know why. But I swear, like I was looking at it like this. And for some reason, it looked like, like looking at it from that angle, it just looked like all of those pieces were moving down. I don't know what it was. I don't know what sort of like visual register was missing that made me think it was the, the room moving. But that is why I like freaked out for a second. Cause I was like, do you not see it? I feel like I'm like, cause even now I can see it. Like I can see how I thought that was the room. I, th I think it's just like, it's, it's the, it's the exact number of things moving and not moving to, to sort of work like, like an illusion. Sort of re regain my 
my bearings here. Get over here. You can totally see that, but it's still funny to rib you about it. It's not to me! <laughs> And, uh, what's the point of this? Okay. Gregory Padawan. No, I can figure this out. Gregory Padawan. Greg Padawan. Oh, wait, hold on. There's too much fucking shit on me. I can't breathe. Okay, I want to know... How to get this chest. And a circle around here somewhere. Oh, interesting. Huh. You like No, no. It's over. My Padawan is impatient. Weren't we all once? The question is, how will he overcome it? In good time. What about in bad time? Did a oh. High Republic data disk. I bet Z would have some use for it. It's so over. How do we get how do we get in that room? I'm crazy. I'm insane. How do we get over there? Bop, bop, bop. Oh, hold on a second. No, not quite. No, not quite just yet. There was an echo thing over there that I completely neglected to pick up. Oh, idea. A couple ideas. Grab this. I've never known Santari Cree to shirk from a challenge. No, and she seems exceptionally driven by this particular task. Task? Stop and fucked up. Hey. No, I, I. Oh man, I didn't know we were gonna be getting anything else. I just ate like a big bowl of <laughs> Damn it. Uh, George just came in and asked if I want Taco Bell, and I'm like, fuck, I do, but I'm not hungry.
truly the worst thing that could happen, probably. Oh, what's that? Ah! What the fuck? What? Oh, it's like a broken and busted. Oh, I didn't actually have to... I thought this was, like, gonna be something like... I don't know. Did I, like, get an orb from there? Maybe? I think? <laughs> I don't know. I'm, I'm going insane, man. I'm all turned around. I think I just got one of the orbs from here. I thought there was, like, a secret there. No, I think... I think it's literally just... Oh! Hold on! Wait a second. There's a way. Wait, 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 wait. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Got it. Mike, 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 Mike. You see what you've done? I don't know who you are. I don't know where you are. But you might want to start thinking about changing your ways. Or changing your name. have an idea. Don't know how well it's going to work. Can I reach this from here? can't. Well... Shit, yeah. Not working out. <laughs> okay. I... Uh, I need, like, a third orb or something. Because I can get up that way. What do you keep... Secret meeting. How oh, cute. Scratchy writing on a wall written in a hasty and easily translated childish cipher. Meet at the usual place later? Cute. Oh, hold on. Got it. It's as easy as that, folks. And then... We can toss this orb through here. I think. Yeah! Yeah! And that's how we get the chest. Diligence! Whoa! Dilly jeans. Very cool. And then, get this. We can just grab this one from here. Wait, actually, the gate will close the moment we pull it out. Unless... Aha! We were quick enough. So now we just have a spare orb. We don't even need it. Well, we might need it. What's this?
Dexterity. I will take it. And we completed the rumor. Uh, okay. Well, we'll find out what that perk is later. Oh. Oh, it's just an on switch. We did have just an extra one at that point. Oh, I think we got everything. I mean, it's hard to tell. There's not like an individual, uh... Oh, no shit, there is! 100% explored. There it is at the bottom. I forgot. They do separate completion percentage by area. Very helpful. Okay, we gotta get to this, this forest array. Let's see. I think it's just down here. Because, uh... Yeah, it's like that way. Yeah, okay. So we head down this way. And then through this path... Will be the forest ray. Which means this is something else entirely. And we should go check it out while we're here. We might as well. Another detour. <laughs> leave me alone, leave me alone. Leave me alone, leave me alone! Bye! Exit pursued by a Mogu. Damn it, I said a Mogu again. Fuck. All right, let's go this way. There is only the force. What's this other one? Oh, oh, they can cost multiple slots. That's a problem. A lightsaber throws deal more damage. Oh, man. Sorry, resilience. No! I can't, I can't equip either. Okay, we'll wait, we'll wait. I assume we can upgrade something like that. Also, yeah, so y'all were right in that. Yeah, there are two other stances that we're gonna unlock later, or at least some kind of like other weapon uh, thing. I totally, I didn't even think about that. Yeah, locked skill. Or, so what's survival? Let's do... Do improve stim formula. And radial push. I know what one of them is, I won't say, but I am baffled as what the fifth could be. I think I know what one of them is uh, as well. Um because I had I had heard about it in like pre-release like preview stuff and then I had forgot about it but unfortunately someone mentioned it earlier in chat and reminded me of its existence so I'm back to knowing about it <laughs> but yeah the fifth one I have literally no clue Up we go! Woo! Uh. 
Why would you, why would you, don't, don't speculate on what it could be. If you know about stuff in the game we haven't seen yet. What are you doing? I, I know you don't actually know for sure whether it is or not. But I didn't even know that was a thing at all. <laughs> I didn't want to know about that. Oh, okay. Okay, let me, um... I, I need to take a look at this. Let's see. Why am I, like, stumped right now? Oh, it's because there's, like... Nothing I can do except... Stand right here. This does not activate. I, uh, I, I guess there's like not much I can do here. I guess I just don't have the thing I need. Okay. Yeah, no, ex explosives. I I was I was referring to your message. Um if that was in the trailers, then that's one thing, but also like I didn't know about it. <laughs> that would have been really cool to find out. But all but also again, if it was in the trailers, then that's I figure that's fair play. I apologize. Yeah, no, I, I think, yeah, I, 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 I don't think something like that would be a stance. It seems like the stances are going to be, like, big upgrades. Especially one of the ones that I do, like, actually almost for certain know about. Um, if it is a stance, it's, like, it's going to be, like, a big upgrade, essentially. Um, so, like, that fifth one... You got to imagine that's going to be like end game shit, right? Like that's got to be like near the end. So I'm wondering just how big something like that could be. And I genuinely I have no concept of what that could possibly be. Too scared. Just blast when you see him. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm pretty sure I told you that before. <laughs> You know what? Fuck this. I'm <laughs> going. <laughs> get the target or get the enemy. Make up your minds. Over here, I'm fighting the thing. Die. What did that do? It seemed like it did anything. Oh, wait. Let me up. Oh, I see. Oh, come on. Nope. I did a pull. I did a force pull. Brought me all the way. Very cool. I just do not have the time for these big fights right now. Is what I'm saying. I gotta get this. I gotta get this forest array. Don't know what that stuff is, but definitely doesn't look safe. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh my god. What is? 
<laughs> what just happened? Okay. Well, well, yeah, you were right about that stuff not being safe, I guess. How to avoid? What the hell? What am I looking at? That is so weird. You just got gray good. Whoa! Oh no! That's a whole floor I can't touch. Maybe Z could tell us more about this. They're not. No, there's. Yeah, I don't. So I don't know how how much it reads on stream. Those are not like bugs. They're literally just like here. Let me. Uh, you know what? They're like. They're like little. Like little crystals. You see that? Cool. <laughs> they just like move around like a, ooh, that's creepy. I love it. Yum, yum, yummy. Give me more. Yummy, yummy. Uh-oh, uh-oh. What the <laughs> fuck are you doing? You think this substance has anything to do with the array? Kobo dust. Highly volatile matter unique to this system of galaxy or of the galaxy. Without further analysis, the elements comprising this gaseous substance remain a mystery. Wow, okay. Um, well... <laughs> okay, well... Oh, I see. It's like, where to? Man, something is like tickling. I'm like, my, my face is getting tickled. Is it my hair? I keep brushing it out of my face and it keeps coming back. Dude, what the... F Hold on. Get out of here! I'd shave it all off if I wasn't so damn cute. Oh yeah, it's, that's uh, the Kobo dust. The fucking 40 Jedi survivor the experience. The if the rest of Z's story is true, the key wow. to should be around here somewhere. You know, I'm remembering like there's kind of a a similar place in the first game, right? There was like a whole temple, like over, overworld kind of thing. It was a lot smaller, but I remember it was cool. Focus. Yeah, on Zepho. Come on, buddy. No! 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 Man, I can't even hang off of this thing. I'll start getting eaten right away. Oh, workbench. Give me a sec. I want to tweak a few things. Actually, would love to take a look at the new pieces I got. Oh, diligence emitter. So cool. And I also got, uh, what else? One of these, right? Harmony? Oh, that looks so cool. Wow, that is a sleek looking saber. Oh, and it looks even better with this one. 
then... If I put patience back on. That might look even better. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, that comes together real nice. Ooh. -hoo. Slap it together like that. It's a pretty good... Pretty good look. Although... It does make me want to change these two out. To... Just give you the... Permit emitter? Oh, yeah, not too shabby. So cool. The materials, maybe. Do we want to go Fisher Price? Actually, the Jedi White kind of looks really sick. <laughs> you want to? You want to go for like a full? Let's go full Fisher Price saber for a little bit. <laughs> Baby's first lightsaber. Oh, cute. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Literally looks like an old, like, derelict toy. Barbie Prince's lightsaber? Actually canon. Actually canon. All set. <laughs> it looks so good. It looks so cute. Aw. Wait, that's adorable. Starter metal. Maybe like chromium. Like a very low amount of polish, so it looks like kind of like a shitty plastic. You have to go pink blade now? No, you're absolutely right. Oh my god! <laughs> Literally! Barbie's dream saver. Oh my god. Black rubber! Oh my god, the rubber! Or the hard plastic! Oh my god. Yes. 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 Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Keep that one purple. Then we do white for the grip. This is those girl nerf guns they made for some reason. True. Oh, man. I... I fucking love... our Barbie dream saber. Could be a good look. <laughs> yeah, you don't say. Yeah, we gotta go with the... the, the pink, purple, and white is, is like the perfect color scheme for this. Oh my god, he's so into it. I know. Can you blame him? Now now I have to change the components even to make this look like as toy like as possible. Oh my god. You're kidding me. You are kidding me. With how close we can get here. What the 
<laughs> yeah, no, the hermit stuff looks so toy-like. Oh my god! Why does all the hermit stuff look like a toy design? It's literally perfect. <laughs> there is no way. This is literally the coolest thing. We li we literally have like a like a Barbie lightsaber. Oh my god. BD1, come on. Cal and BD1 walk up to the box office uh ticket window. Two tickets for the Barbie movie, please. Ready to roll with this. Should we do it to BD1? Should we make Barbie BD1? Yes. Yeah. Okay. You know what? I do wish you could like... I wish you could save like presets. I would love to save like color presets. That's, that's like the one feature that's missing here. Because I would feel a lot better about like experimenting with stuff if I could save presets. So we're going to keep his primary color, this, um, Inquisitor White, or do we want to go Jedi White? Jedi White, for sure. Then for secondary, we can do the purple anodized metal. <gasps> no! Oh, that's perfect. Wait, and then if we bring the polish down. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> okay. Then accent color. That's where we'll get pink with it. There is no fucking way. Actually, let's go the other way around. Do chorus on pink on the secondary and then corundum on the on the accent. Holy shit. Condition. Let's do right, pristine. Then. And then. I have to switch out some parts here. I don't know. I it doesn't. It doesn't feel like it's entirely coming together. I think I might want to go pink for like the full body, actually. And then. From there, do everything else. It's not, it's the problem. Yeah, the problem is that it's not like pink enough. Ooh, the orchid I think works great for the Barbie vibes. Is it just the lighting you think? Yeah, maybe. Okay, let's see if we can get him looking feeling about this material. more toy-like. Uh, let's go to the head. Is there anything? Scrapyard is pretty good. Rugged is pretty good. I don't know. Thinking... Scrapyard isn't it. There's too too many wires. It's either BD1 or Rugged, I think. Yeah, Astro does look like look the most like a toy. I think you're correct. But then the colors aren't right on this one. But we can we can recolor it. I think if we get the if we get the toyness of it correct. Yeah, what about his body? New look for you, Shit. BD. Same great attitude. <laughs> Same great attitude. Oh, we definitely gotta do rugged. And then for the legs, we gotta do either Astro. Yeah, I think I think it's Astro. Okay, and now we can recolor. Um
Polish all the way down. He needs to be built like something a kid would slam onto the ground. True. I, I think we're onto something here. I think we got it. Speaking of, let's make them well kept. Just making sure all the polish is gone. Very so cool. Okay. We <laughs> Holy shit. This is the most valid thing I've ever seen in my life. Are you kidding me? Total, total glam cow. Can we do anything with the clothes to really like even bring this further together? I'm kind of obsessed right now. Yo. Okay. White scoundrel vest. Purple rebel hero jacket. Or shirt, sorry. And then white scoundrel pants. Oh my god! He's so ready. This is insane. Press the sleigh button. Don't look at him! With the pink blade! Oh my god, it's perfect! It's fucking perfect! Holy shit! Wait, come on, BD1, wait. <laughs> Holy fuck. This is so important to me. <laughs> Woke Star Wars be like. This is, oh my God, guys. We just got a first exclusive preview of Ryan Johnson's Star Wars trilogy. And the fans are seething. I'm starting to think purple rebel hero is the way to go. Sorry, I just, I, it has to be perfect. I hope you understand. It has to be perfect. I think this is the best we got. Okay. Yeah, I like this. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's fucking go. Oh man, this is gonna be amazing. And oh my god, guys! Can you imagine the story cutscenes with this drip? I desperately hope we get to see this this lightsaber in a story cutscene. You can change the hair, stuff. yes. You you can you can edit his hair and his beard. We just don't have very many at the moment. We'll get more. Okay, now I just need to I need to remember what I was doing. Okay, lots of stuff here. We can go many ways, it seems. Priority, though, this way. 
Oh. Power's out. This place must have been abandoned and forgotten. Thank I I'm I'm so happy now. All these years later, and she never gave on. up on her mission. We can't let her down. I'm so happy now that I have a title for this VOD. Um, cause y'all know I'm about to title this shit like the Barbie Dream Saber or something. With like the trademark and everything. Finally. I was I was waiting. Cause the first one I was able to name Turgle Marink, which is awesome in its own right. I, w I would give anything for pink for pink outfit like I would I would give anything for pink outfit I desperately hope we get something in pink I will play the entire rest of the fucking game like this I swear to you um if we can find pink clothes and like make it a whole thing like I'll do it I think that creature is trapped I can't cut it free let's pass under it for now I will I will literally play Star like Barbie Star Wars Jedi Survivor happily. Yeah, we're we're gonna we're about to yesify a galaxy far, far away. I just joined stream and I'm so confused on the Barbie theme, but I'm living for it. It's, it's we have we have the Barbie Dream Saber and the Barbie BD1. Available for purchase now at a, at, at your local Walmart toy aisle or Toys R Us. It's as simple as that. Okay, we can make it. I was wondering, I was like, I don't think that was like, that doesn't seem possible very much, but I was mistaken. Hunter shirt. Nope, no thank you. Not interested. If it's not glamtastic, if it's not fabulous, get it the fuck out of my sight at this point. I have a new mission. Literally, like, like I, I, I've received a celestial vision, a mission from God. With the, with the dream saber. Can I grab onto that, maybe? No. Oh, oh, there's another thing I can climb. Oh, I see. Hold on. I cannot believe I missed that. That thing. There we go. Yeah. What if it's pink? If it's pink, I will I will do it. But there it's not. It's not pink. Look. See? Okay, it, they keep sending me back here. I'm I'm running out of places to go, which I, honestly, I guess is a good thing. Uh process of elimination that way. I need to get rid of these things before doing that path, I guess. So, uh, I guess we just go this way. We can. We're kind of blocked, too. Yeah, okay. Not happening there. Oh. These stupid chickens one hit kill you on hard mode for some reason. I'm sorry to hear that. 
Oh, shit. Oh, I there's, there was a whole nother path there I completely missed. My bad. I got confused. Hold on. No! <laughs> what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? <laughs> Panic until I die seemed to be the... Maybe not the correct answer, but the automatic answer. Oh my god! Again, I missed I missed a grate. I missed another grate. These things keep blending into the environment. Perhaps if they had some like yellow paint slashed all over over them. No! That hurt. Mean, 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 mean. God damn it. No, he dissolved into the grate. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. <laughs> At least I'm losing like only like slivers of health. I'm so fucking pissed that it happened again. It just happened twice in a row. I'm starting to panic. Just, just go. I need to stop jumping. Let's go this way. It's simple. Let me up, you... Okay. Sorry. Gonna calm down. <laughs> Ugh. That thing sheds. I think it's actually faster to not jump. Yeah, no, I, like, I get that impression, too. It's just, it's hard. It's hard for me not to jump. You understand. Yeah, Penny loves jump. What can I say? Something around here has a big appetite. There it is. I knew it. <laughs> I remembered this shot. I remember this shot from one of the trailers. I was like, something is about to jump down from there. It's so funny. My God. Monkey. Monkey. There he is, just waiting for me. Claws primed, ass out. Bothered, none. Worth it, worth it. Beanie, stay here. Not worth it. Oh my god, he's insane. These guys are crazy. <laughs> you know what? I should maybe. Three. First of all, I'm gonna I'm gonna put the <laughs> unlocked by my own aesthetic joke it's extremely good like i actually just really like it i like i'm i'm delighted that you can do something like that in this game 
like that you can capture such a specific vibe with the customization tools is it a joke at this point i don't know i don't think so anymore i think i really am just enjoying playing with my barbie dream saber Dude, oh my god. Okay, hold on. Man, you need to quit. I fucking can't stand these guys. There we go. seen tech like this before and I scrapped some serious machines on Braca oh man I came in at Barbie dream saber and I'm all for it thank you thank you so much a, a new a new frontier has been discovered in our uh, in our playthrough and that is how close can we get to the ultimate fucking girly pop Calcastus of our dreams? Diligence switch. We'll have to take a look at that. I don't know, man. If it doesn't look like it's a it's a Fisher Price toy or like a Mattel product, not interested at this point. scan we've seen this tech before just not on this scale true the end goal dead ass be turning cal into alan or redhead ken true oh my god yeah good point huh. just like z's chamber So that is how you burn them. I think I think Barbie Saber and Hot Wheels BD would be a strong combo, but I can't deny the strength of what you created. Okay. That's an extremely fucking good idea. Like, I will admit, I'm not going to lie. That's 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 that is a visionary idea. I am I am down to introduce other aesthetics into the equation. But right now, I am singularly focused on on the the Barbie's Dreamland aesthetic. This is bad. This is bad. I did not realize what I was getting into. Hold on. Whoa! Holy shit! I see how I see now how they can kill you with one hit. <laughs> Fisher Price era penny every fucking day. And proud of it. Buddy. Let's see. Oh, I understand. Okay. And thank God birds were just something that George Lucas made up. Could you imagine? I came up with these fucked up little creatures. Uh, I call Other them birds. Days. 
and they're they're evil and they're not good creatures they're evil they have horrible horrible faces nightmarish talons and, uh, everyone in the in the galaxy hates them because they were hated first no way we're crossing that still breathing Well, I completely lost the key of that. That's okay. You forgive me. <laughs> with, with Barbie drip like that, there's no way you're not a Jedi. I, I did notice Cal was like floating upwards while I was singing. I didn't point it out, but it did not go unnoticed, believe me. Me looking through the 3 a.m. dashboard on Tumblr. Critters around the array are pretty riled up. Critters! Could be the dust in the air. Imperial patrols probably don't help either. I love the word critters. Reminds me of Applejack. And then I smile and get happy about it. Confusion, major fauna. This will come in handy. To confuse large creatures, yes! Uh, confused enemies will attack Cal if no hostiles are near. Okay, got it. Bigger, bigger. Bigger confusion. Rest up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. I just keep looking at the map and just being like, wow, yeah. And we and we still we are still at only 28.7% completion of Kobo. We are still on Kobo. This is the second planet of the game. It's sealed. Yeah, no, like this this whole like thing right here. This section would be like I don't know, at least like half of a level of its own in the first game. Like, maybe that's inaccurate, but, like, still. Yes! Uh, yes! Nice. Get him! That could be trouble. Or maybe he could us a hand. He says, way too late. <laughs> it's fun to watch. Yeah, not so easy to force push that attack, is it? Look at those. Uh oh. <laughs> 
damn it. You know, they gotta remember that's there. Whoa. What, what's getting rid of your health? Me. <laughs> don't, don't know what happened there, but I'll take it. The Empire is way out of their element here. He says holding his Barbie lightsaber. Ah, it's so funny. Whoa. Okay. New tactical material. So you, you can unlock materials for specific uh, cosmetics. Cool. Okay. Noted. Yeah, not pink though. So like, why bother? At least we know, at least we know pink is an option or a possibility, I'll say. Penny like jumping. He really does climb fast enough that I, I don't need to jump when he's climbing. Like, it's just not a problem. Noted. What's gonna attack? Nothing? Okay. Don't know about that just yet. Oh, hello. <gasps> Careful, BD. He's just curious. Roar! Whoa. I don't know what else to say. Seer, I, I, I thought... No, you didn't think. You perceived a threat and reacted. If the Order had reacted faster, we'd still have a Republic. The Empire, the Haxian brood, half the galaxy wants us dead. Yes. <laughs> the odds are against us. But they will always be against us. Cal, you can't fight your way out of some situations. He's got a point. <gasps> Whoa! Yeah! Finally! Here we go. Stop being mad. This isn't the time to fight. Cal can now glide with Relters! Yes! Oh, yeah. Let's fucking go! Now this is more my speed. Oh, yeah. Woo! So cool, so cool down here oh death and demise noted barbie's relter adventure <laughs> uh gonna get a lot of mileage out of this one i can tell you now i can tell you now The way this looks reminds me of something in particular, but I can't place it. I think I know what you mean. But I can't place it either. Just so you know. <laughs> for, for hell? I hope you're ready. Fight by my side. Betrayal. Oh, damn it. I wanted to stab him in the back. <laughs> Let's fight together. Come on. Come on. Very cool. <laughs> Imagine 
being grabbed from behind and seeing a threat before being stabbed. Yeah, that's what happened. <laughs> really, like, like, you, like you're about to be the victim of like a Metal Gear Solid stealth kill, but with your final breath, you say, "I hope you're ready." Like, let it go, man. It's over. What are you doing? What are you trying to prove? <laughs> oh, it's killing me. This entire structure is the array. But what's it for? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I don't know. That just tickles me. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. You better hope it saves you from dying. Nope. Sorry. Stop! <laughs> Stop! Gross! Quit! What? I see. Find out. It's a very cool visual effect. I cannot imagine the bitrate is taking too kindly to this right now. Oh, it hates it? Yeah, I figured. Here, I'll look at the floor. Uh oh, never mind. Be free! Whoa! Just notice how cool the sky looks. Beautiful. Gorgeous game. Truly. Shit's beautiful. What am I... Hold on. What am I doing here? Oh, I guess just going up this way? Oh yeah, oh yeah, cause now cause now we can climb up there and the thing won't knock us down. We're stuck in this stuff. Looks like that weird matter around here can take on various forms. Let's hope that tower at the top of the array has some answers. Various forms, yeah. <laughs> Uh, I guess this is where I'm supposed to be. Okay, new hunter materials. Still not interested, but appreciate the offer. Okay, here we go. Are in business. What is, um. That's something I'll have to continue to investigate at some point. Oh, gosh. What do you think is up there? I don't know. What does it matter? Well, I mean, I'm your ally. <laughs> That's what it matters. Man. Yeah. Watch out! Hurry, end it! I bought that. You want to protect me. Nice! Now that's what I call shortcuts.
The fact that there is like so much ground I can cover once this uh, Kobo dust is not around makes me very delighted and also yet again extremely stressed out because I'm just like how am I gonna beat this game on stream man I'm gonna have to play this for like seven hours a day for the next week chamber we're getting close get me close there's those spy droids again they're not the only ones interested in the array who are interested in the array. Someone to talk to. I hope they like Barbie. We've searched all over the array, buddy. This is our last stop. If the key to Tantalor is real, it has to be here. And if not, maybe Z does have a screw loose. Rehabilitation wing. I need to focus. Okay. I hope that this is not another like full section. Because I will say, uh, at the next, like, kind of, like, after this mission, basically, I think I'm going to call it. So that after what we're doing familiar. here at the array, because I am getting tired, but also, this must be I do want to finish this mission. Key to Tantalor was sealed away for centuries now. Did it. Sounds like the array is powering up. Time for some answers. There's lava inside that trading card. Oh shit, it's the trailer thing. Whoa. It's a hollow rare, lava rare. What the fuck? Welcome to Tantalor. It's beautiful. Remind me not to let you name the next world we discover. Give it time. You didn't like me much at first either. Jury's still out. to believe this paradise was hiding on just the other side of the abyss this is elder scrolls man <laughs> like what is this come on i want to show you something renowned jedi knight dagging gara offers to be my escort on an uncharted world <laughs> how could i refuse without your guidance i'd never have made it here in one piece oh careful now or well, someone might think you've learned humility. Okay. Well. Guess we're doing more gameplay. Whoa, whoa! Ah! It's got flashbangs. 
I'm so glad this is kind of matching our aesthetic right now. Force is strong here. It's just as I told you. We'll build the temple here. Yes. My thoughts exactly. Okay. Ow, God. <laughs> the brightness on my monitor is not helping with those, like, solid white screens. Simply wonderful. Yes, it's perfect. I've seen the galaxy, Santari, and there are many worlds that the light of the Jedi does not reach. I'm going to petition the High Council to train initiates here. Fontana Lord. But it can be so challenging to access. What if something were to go wrong? Our temple will be a bastion for the Order here at the galactic frontier. The Abyss blocks comm signals. We'll have to invite a member of the Jedi Council to visit in person. Hmm. for hours council members are not known for their hasty judgments especially master run thesis my duel with the gendai didn't take this long you won in the end be patient not one of my strong suits well if you're going to teach younglings you had better learn younglings hell yeah i have faith in you so does the council Trust them to do the right thing. What's wrong? Uh oh. Warn the others. We're under attack. Whoa. Yellow blade. You're not here. Whoa! You're not supposed to be here. Release me. What the fuck? Please. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, you're just gonna do it? Okay, sure. Yeah. I don't see why not. I see no reason why not. What the fuck? That's so cool! That thing looks so cool! I would probably have no qualms about releasing, uh, releasing this guy at this point. Oh my god! I'm what is called a barbine. The Sith Lord corrupted the Republic. 
turned it into an empire. They destroyed the order. They're hunting down those of us that are left. But you're here now. We can fight them together. Hmm. Doesn't feel right. Wow. This is so cool. We're so back. The order is gone. I must return to Tanlor. What happened there? How'd you end up here? We were invaded. I held them at bay as long as I could, but... There were too many. The battle was horrific. Oh. Still, we weren't beaten. Not yet. Not until the Jedi Council gave the order to abandon Tanalor and then <gasps> refused to counterattack. Oh, no! <laughs> they gave uh -oh. up Yes. It was my discovery. My home, and they just expected me to throw it away. No way! Daddy, no, no, no! I fucking knew it. I Come on! I and was betrayed by the one I trusted most. No, stop! <gasps> oh shit! And that's that, what I guess. I mean, it was kind of clear we were going to be going this route, right? Like, I'm not the only one who... Yeah. Wow. Can I be honest? Didn't know how they made the lightsabers red. It makes a lot of sense now. <laughs> That's really fucking cool. Whoa, okay. So I just processed. I was like, I just started pressing buttons and I was like, oh shit, we're like fighting this guy. This new guy. That was th literally just such an incredible moment. That's like nothing. I'm, I'm delighted. That's nothing. Hey, why does your fucking lightsaber look like that? Well, you see, I'm a Barbie girl in a Barbie world. Oh, cow. Oh, oh, oh. Over here. Meager. Such a pity. Help, please. Still green, hmm? No. What? It's pink. <laughs> Face me. Shit. Man, I I'm sorry that I my brain refuses to parry. And I'm gonna say my brain to absolve myself for responsibility Such a for this shortcoming. Okay. Hey, buddy. More. Paltry. You can't win. Whoop. Is that it? Is that it? No, I have other stuff. Just give me like a few hours, okay? I'm I'm in the middle of like what 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 you call a progression system. Green. Mm -hmm. Whoa! 
That was cool. That was some anime shit. Desperate. Such a chore. That's nothing. Woo! Okay. I will not be imprisoned again. Stand against me. Stop! 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 We're all that's left. Stop! What happened to you? <laughs> Whoa! 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 Oh, Ravis. I should have known you would honor your oath. What? <laughs> Wait! <gasps> what the fuck is going on? Where's Turgle? We need to catch this asshole. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. The key to Tantalor. Could Kree have met Dagon? How could she entrust Tantalor to someone like him? Okay. Inciting incident? Two! What do we get? Nice. I will take it. Jesus Christ. Okay. Um. Gonna head back. Yeah, a lot just went down. That was so sick. Law was supposed to bring us closer, but all it did was divide our order. The council may have given up on you, but I know who you truly are, Dagon. Even if you yourself have forgotten. She had such faith in him. At least she never had to see him fall to the dark side. Dead wife montage. <laughs> Dagon, stop! <laughs> oh, happy birthday. Not a bad view, huh, buddy? Wonder if Grease and Boat fixed the mantis by now. Probably. I don't know. I don't know things. Holy shit, that was a really cool dismount. Okay. Focus. I'm going to I'm going to rest up and then can we not fast travel? Okay. Um I'm wondering if I should head back now or if I should stop now. I want to head back and like regroup, you know? I'm going to I'm going to keep going. I'm not going to stop just yet. I'm going to go back. We'll we'll stop when we get back to the the saloon. Look at this.
There's an Easter egg near where the manta is. Okay. Uh, we'll check it out. Oh, I gotta like go to a new place. Oh, up here. Let's see. Yeah, new new Sith just dropped. Holy shit! Honest to God, this is so cool. Is I'm real. loving the vibes of this story it so may far. Be the last corner of this galaxy that's safe from the Empire. I wish you could have seen it too, BD. That's weird. That's weird. Don't like that. Um, I was gonna say like, I'm loving this. This is like this is a flavor of Star Wars that I kind of didn't really know existed. Um, and I'm really, really enjoying it. Get out of here. Yeah! Yes! Easy. Come on. We won't hurt you. <laughs> yeah! Oh, here we go! Neko Mount! Let's fucking go! Oh, we can get through this thing now. But yeah, like this, this is just a whole ass new flavor of Star Wars that I... I didn't know was there. I'm excited to learn about it. Um, it's just a lot of good stuff happening. I'm just... I'm, very pleased with this experience so far. Here we go. And I, and I do really hope that the game is able to improve on platforms in a way that will allow people to appreciate it all the same in time. I, I genuinely, I just, I hope to God that this game's legacy is not like tarnished forever because of its release date, you know? There's some good shit here. That gate with a little boost from her new friend. You can Yoshi! You can Yoshi! You can Yoshi! <laughs> Look at that! You can Yoshi this guy! <laughs> Look at that! Brown! Brown! What is this? <gasps> no way! Swooper! That looks pretty toy-like. Give that one a go. Still thinking about Turkle? Oh. Aren't we all? You know your way around Kobo, don't you? Was there at least a sale when you bought it? No, it just came out. <laughs> Literally just released uh, a couple days ago. Time to go. One way door. Figured. <laughs> I was Ready like, why game? bother? <laughs> Never buy full price. Hey, you do you. I fully disagree. Like, you know. I I like playing games on release. One, I mean it's my job <laughs> to do so. To be fair. Good, Neko. But also, yeah, sometimes you, like, uh, you don't want to, sometimes you just don't want to miss out on the fucking conversation. Like, whatever. I, d I don't think it's a never kind of situation. I think that is, like, way too, as way too, I don't know, generalized, I guess. Um, Let's yeah, th there, there are some cases where, you know, a new release is not exactly passing the sniff test and you should hold out to see, you know? And absolutely, I would say in that case, waiting a couple days, you know, at the very least, yeah, absolutely go for it. Uh, but like, yeah, for me, like I, I, I mean, I have like, again, I have external incentive to purchase a lot of games on release uh, if I'm electing to stream them. Um, but even then, sometimes, I don't know, I personally, like there is nothing more exciting than a midnight release and also to like really like 
I don't know, I guess dig a little deeper. Like for me, I'm, I'm in a place now where I like have the disposable income to buy games on release. Um, and that is something that I like cherish. Uh, I truly like, I, I, it like means a lot to me because that was not always the case. You know, I, I grew up like only getting fucking like one game every six months minimum, you know? Uh, damn. <laughs> and I, and you know, and, and, and I've never really, I guess, reached a point where I'm like, I don't know. I, I guess All I'm right. still I'm still Let's a little go. stingy about the fact that I am like actually able to get games when I want to now. You know, like I won't give that up. I don't care. Un unless it's just looking like real dire. You know, I I feel like a game like Jedi Survivor it kind of caught everyone off guard. Like I don't know. From like maybe. Maybe there was some evidence that I missed that could have implied that it was going to release in the state it did. But like, I, I personally, I had like basically no expectation of that. So at that point, I don't know. What do you do then? You just, I mean, if your philosophy is never buy on release, then again, yeah, totally. You do you. And in, in that case, you know, you kind of got the upper hand means. here, in which case, uh, far off. a bit jealous for sure, <laughs> but also, but then sometimes, uh, God of War Ragnarok, <laughs> I'll just say, <laughs> I'll just, I'll end my, I'll end my discussion with that. That's, that's the, that's the end of my thoughts. Just, just throwing out the name of another video game. Did you like it? Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you enjoyed. And for more uh, totally infallible arguments, uh, donate on Patreon. <laughs> now. This is a nice one. We have six shards. I waited for sale and got fallen order for eight dollars. I mean, that's pretty sick. I like, yeah, no, like that's hey, that's fantastic. I'm I'm very happy to hear it, but also like, how long did that take? <laughs> like, was that? Was that like a like a flash surprise sale like a month after release or was that like half a year? Because me personally, I'm not waiting half a year to play a game I want to play. Unless I literally have no other choice. And that's just me. I like I'm a very impatient person, I will admit. I am, I am generally kind of impulsive and that's just something I've accepted about myself. I like I I'm a, I'm allowed to be impulsive about I think leisure, you know. <laughs> I was like you missed out cuz it was on sale for $4 less spring. <laughs> Stop! You can't do them like that. Let's stop here. Oh shit, yeah, it is free on Game Pass. It's true. There's always gonna be another sale. Except with Nintendo. There they are. What? Oh, that wait, they're they what is going on? Where am I going? <laughs> I want to get back to the mantis. I don't want to stream anymore. <laughs> Let me out. Let me out.
What is going on? How do you Oh, okay. This is like all bonus. I can just go. I can just go. Okay, I can just go. I can just go. I understand now. It's kind of weird to have this backtrack path and you can just fast travel back. Yeah, but I couldn't. That's the thing. You literally can't. They don't. Whoa! It's because they want you to see this. Come on, BD. Let's meet him at the landing pad. They will sometimes kind of arbitrarily limit your fast travel, which I think is a little bit of a weird design choice. Uh, but I get it. You know, they want they they do they wanted you to go back through this path and like see the fun mantis cutscene and everything. Wow! Look at it. So cool. Yeah, we just we gotta respect the set pieces. Yeah. Yeah. What what was that? That was kind of a that's kind of a fruity little yeah. It's just me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wahoo! The Mushroom Kingdom? Or no, it's a... Uh, Yahoo! Mamma Mia! The Mushroom Kingdom? Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> Wahoo! Mamma Mia, the Mushroom Kingdom? Let's go! Yeah! <laughs> That's like one of the funniest videos in existence. Mamma Mia. I know, oh, great, great. <laughs> new, new fucking. What is it? Was it with Echolalia? Is that a thing I can I can claim? I don't know. Anyway, knew that just dropped. Z, <laughs> you're looking good as new. Indeed, that mechanical mixologist is a miracle worker. I must know, did you locate yeah. the key to Tannenor? Uh, it's complicated, but we'll find it. Monk told me what transpired while I was asleep. To think the Jedi Order is no more, that must have been dreadful for you. We have both been through so much, but we must persevere, Cal. After all, what else is there to do? Aww. That's right. Aww, that, was, that was actually really sweet. You've got room for one more? I shall remain here, but if you need my counsel, I will be at the saloon. I am very fortunate to have met you, Cal Kestis. I fucking love Z with all of my heart. Which probably means she's gonna make me really, really sad at some point. I found something out there. Maybe yeah, that's pessimistic. The Jedi from the time of the High Republic somehow preserved him back to Dagon Gera. I freed him. What happened? He attacked me, escaped with the Bedlam Raiders. He's who they've been looking for. Says the Jedi betrayed him. And turn to the dark side. Are you okay, kid? Tantalor. It's real grease. It's hidden somewhere in the abyss. Oh, that's impossible. The abyss eats any ship that gets too close. The Republic found a way through hundreds of years ago. That's why they built that array in the forest. A hidden world that nobody has been able to reach for centuries. If you figured out how to cross the abyss, you could just disappear completely. No Bedlam Raiders, no Bounty Hunters, no Galactic Empire. I'm just spitballing here, but that does sound like a place that someone could call home. Yeah. Yeah, it could be a home. 
Get your feet down. Uh, all right, <laughs> I'm going back to the cantina. You know, Grease, we could use a real pilot. I don't know. I mean, you're doing okay on your own. I mean, you could clean the Patoli weave every now and then. We day. don't know the mantis like you do. Nobody does. Yeah, come back, Grease. Come back. Oh, Cal, I'm, I'm sorry. My best days are behind me. I, I can't even hold my card steady. I know things are different from how they used to be, but well, I'm not sure I could do this without you. Come on. Is that really how you feel? It is. Well, I mean, Man, I guess I'm... I could have Monk keep his eye on the saloon. Greasy money. <laughs> Greasy money. <laughs> I mean, there's not going to be much in the way of credits. Cal, this is better than any score. Imagine, no more looking over your shoulder. A safe place for us, for the ones we love. If anyone knows about a lost Jedi world, it's here. Jedi! Aha! It's about time you paid that lady a visit. <laughs> All right, I'm going to make us some food before we go. He's making food. Welcome back to the outpost. Don't forget to visit Domas with any rare minerals, okay? Plant seeds in the rooftop garden, okay? Meet more residents. Z has a shop! Z's shop in the upper floor of the Pylon Saloon is now accessible. High Republic data disc found across the galaxy can be spent here. In a rooftop garden, seeds collected across Kobo can be planted here. Oh, man. Wow. Yeah, okay. New planet unlocked. Um, hey, tell me if this is mean. I think currently, honestly, I'm feeling like my main interest in Cal Kestis as a character is that he is sort of a bridge or a gateway to other characters that I actually like. <laughs> I don't, I don't dislike Cal Kestis, but I, I don't really, it's, he's kind of given me nothing. Am I crazy? Like, like he's had a few moments here and there where he's like fine. And like, you know, a couple enjoyable lines here and there, but like so far, I have like nothing to say about this guy. He really is just kind of. He is just a, a vehicle for the everybody else to be like infinitely more interesting. Um, which is crazy because like at that point, let us make our own character. <laughs> like why? Like it's it they they go through the the whole rigmarole of like making him this defined character with a name and a backstory and everything and like he has a history and he's friends with these people but so far in this game they're just giving him like nothing to do emotionally save for like a couple key moments that have long since passed now and i don't know like okay granted we're still very early. I, this is n I'm not writing him off entirely with this, right? This is just my current like gut feelings. Um, and also granted a lot of this stream was spent doing like side content on Kobo. Um, so maybe I'm just like, I haven't had, I haven't seen the opportunities they're going to take with him later. I'm hoping that's the case, but like, I just don't know. I'm I'm really not feeling anything with him right now, which is crazy because I love like everybody else. I think this game has such an incredible cast of characters. Every single other character in this game is just rich and vibrant and so full of like personality and appeal. And then the guy you play as so far is the most like just nothing guy 
<laughs> like, I feel like, okay, this is where I'm starting to feel a little mean, so I'm gonna stop there. But like, I just wanted to express that because I've been kind of back and forth on it this stream where like, I don't know if it's, I don't know if it's the writing, I don't know if it's the performance. I honestly, and like, and this is no, no shade to the actor, I forget his name, uh, Cameron something, but like, I just, I don't feel like he's like doing much and maybe like, that's, I was like, well, maybe it's like an unfamiliarity with the medium, but then like he did, a, he did the whole first game and I, I liked Cal in the first game. I thought he, I thought Cal was still kind of a blank slate in the first one, but I remember liking him a lot more actively than I like him here, which is weird. Like it, it honestly feels like Cal so far kind of like took a step down for me in terms of like immediate appeal. Um, and Lord knows I'm doing my best with the Barbie shit. <laughs> like, I think, I think that's part of why some of that is so funny to me. Cause I'm like, it's, it's like, we're like, we're like force feeding a personality to this guy. <laughs> like, if that makes sense. I don't know. I'll stop there though. I'll stop. I'll stop with the, the roast of Cal Kestis for now. I do hope he gets better. I, I am fully willing to eat my words on this. Like truly. I like I am I'm hoping to eat my words on this. Um honest to god, like I like I I want him to be an interesting character and I'm hoping that uh that happens down the road. So yeah, we'll see. Either way, uh so much to be excited about with uh the remainder of this game. Oh, this was such a fun stream where so yeah, I think I think like first thing tomorrow what I'll probably do is like check out like the garden and stuff, check out Z shop, but I won't spend too much more time. Did I say tomorrow, by the way? I don't, I don't know about tomorrow. Next stream, whenever, um, whenever I stream this again, um, I'm going to, I'm going to check out Z shop. I'm going to check out the gardens, but I'm not going to spend too much time on Kobo for a little bit. I definitely next stream. I, I want to, I want to spend the majority of my time doing like another planet and hopefully a lot more main story to really kind of like make up some of the pace. Tomorrow is Sunday sketchbook, if anything. Yeah, and honestly, at this point, I don't even know if I'm doing that. I'll see. I want to, like Lord knows I want to, but these these past few weekends, um, the weekends kind of for me recently, like I, I, just, I, I just need some time, maybe. I don't know. Like, maybe I shouldn't have streamed today and, like, saved this for tomorrow or something, but I don't know. I might need to just take off tomorrow anyway. I know it's been a little bit since I did Sunday Sketchbook, but um, I'm going to get back to it. I really am. I, I'm, I'm excited to be drawing again, and I need to finish emotes and all kinds of stuff. So I know y'all aren't going to, like, rag on me if I do skip tomorrow. I, I understand that, and I thank you for your patience and your understanding on that. Um, but I, I do still feel the need to just like express like, it's not cause I don't want to like truly, honestly, I've been having so much fun with the drawing streams. Um, it's just the timing of everything and just the, the, the load of everything is definitely pretty heavy right now. So anyway, anyway, I think I'm going to send y'all on over to, let's see, a few people are streaming right now. I don't know who to pick. God damn. You know what? Earlier in the stream tonight, we were graced with uh, the extended presence of my good friend, Holly Hollowtones. Um, so let's, uh, you know, let's, uh, let's return the favor a bit. Let's, uh, let's go say hi to Holly. She's currently playing super lesbian animal RPG. Uh, and is also, uh, I think still doing, yeah, okay, apparently, According to her title, at least, still going with the subathon, um, which I am. I am also uh, definitely going to be trying to find a way to fit a subathon into the near future. So keep an eye out for that. We'll see how that goes. But uh, yeah, let's go say hi to Holly. Uh, do we have any raid phrase ideas? Before we bounce, anything at all? Something, oh yeah, something about, how about uh, yeah, Barbie, yeah, let's do, um, the Barbie dream saber, dream saber as one word. 
the Barbie, and then one word dream saber. How about that? If you want to add a trademark symbol at the end, even better, but that's not mandatory. If it's inconvenient. Yeah, perfect, Mar, you got it. Okay. Perfect. All right. Yeah, Alexa. Flawless. All right, let me set this up. Thank you all so, so much for watching. This is a great one. Six hours. Uh, good pace, I think. Good pace so far. Um, really loving this game. Really enjoying it. I hope y'all are enjoying watching it. So please keep an eye out for future streams, if so. Um, if I don't see you tomorrow, I will see you on Tuesday. Um, and actually, I don't know if it's going to be Jedi Survivor on Tuesday. I think last stream I said Tuesday would be Jedi. I think the plans have changed. You'll know why pretty fucking soon. Um, and then on Wednesday... Oh, man. I'm going to have to find another time to stream Jedi. Because Tuesday is not going to be it. And then Wednesday, I might want to do Dragon Quest because I might have to put Dragon Quest on hiatus soon. I'll figure it out. Anyway, if I don't see you tomorrow, the earliest I'll see you is on Tuesday. Uh, but as for Jedi, just keep an ear out in future streams. I'll let you know what the plan is there. But until then, have a great one. Please, please take care of yourselves. And just be good to yourselves. And have a wonderful night. Rest up. I'm going to be doing that as well. <laughs> All right. Bye-bye.